Hello, hello and welcome to the stream. Merry Wednesday. I heard clapping. <laughs> there you are. Who is this? Who's clapping here? I can't see. Frakes. Ah, uh, welcome. Okay, where are we? We are going to be doing something I've been wanting to do for a very long time. Namely, going back to some places that I think a lot of people forgot existed. Uh, these places came out before Odyssey. And when they came out, it was pretty exciting to go to them. But then Odyssey came around and everyone forgot that these places exist. And, uh, you know, we're all jumping around trying to find some cool stuff out there. But there's stuff right here in the bubble that exists. And there are a lot of fun places to go and interact with stuff. All right. Right now, uh, I am getting my chat window up here. Let's see. Got this. Push the button. Chat window is now up. Yay! Oh seven, everyone. Hello, Joe. Hello, Sakari. Grimulus. So, you guys going to show use the hidden Raxel base too? Well, maybe. Uh, Crisp24. Hello. Mayor J, how are you doing? It's, wow, it's mid half past midnight. What, why am I streaming? I'm just a night owl, you know? I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> why is everybody creeping? Everybody is creeping. Is the gravity really high on my uh, fleet carrier? Is that why all you guys are just crouched, crouched looking around? Now, I'm not sure if this is translating well on the uh, the stream, but I got an amazing view of these rings over here. It's just looking fantastic. We're going to go to these rings in just a second. Uh, if you guys are wondering where we are right now, so am I. Let's go to the map. We are in this place, Chiboniski. <laughs> Do I know how to read? Let's see who's here. We got Rustfang, uh, Martian Turtle, Frakes, and Disemboweled. They're all here. I I think Disemboweled. When I started the stream, I heard an explosion, and then in the Discord he writes, "I forgot the fleet carrier wasn't in Anarchy." So I, I'm assuming that explosion I heard when I first started the stream was was uh, disemboweled, exploding. Okay, so we're on the fleet carrier. However, and we're going to go to several sp places in the bubble, really fun, cool places that I haven't shown you guys yet. I've been holding back on you. I've been holding back on these locations because they're so freaking cool. But now I'm thinking, you know what? Let's go to them. Let's go have some fun. And uh, let's try to figure out some uh, mini games in them, because a lot of them are like uh, installations where you can like fly inside of them. Um, one of them, two of them are a base, and the last one we, you'll you'll see. But in any case, we're going to take the carrier around town. However, you don't need a carrier it, it, to catch up. Um, everything is within reasonable light uh, uh, jump range. As long as I wouldn't recommend running around in a in a ship that does 25 light years or less, um, in case you want to catch up, if you want to stay behind while the fleet carrier takes off, um, uh, you can do that. But um, yeah, 25 light year jumps or less, you might struggle to catch up. But um, again, they're not too far away from each other. All right, just drinking a huge drink of water to uh, drown myself. We are in open. If I'm just going to say that right now. We are in open. We are in Odyssey. However, all these places are um, Horizons friendly. So if you're watching there and you're wondering, why not me, uh, Mars? Why not showcase a place that I can go to? Well, you're in luck. All these places are Horizons friendly. The, reasons why, the reason why we're playing in Odyssey, though, right now for the stream is that the last place we'll go to on this tour um, there's an element that o is only you can only do uh, in Odyssey so instead of like logging out and then everybody has to be like okay let's reinstance with everybody no 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 okay now I have to choose which which ship to should I use I think I should use my dolphin let's see that one's 54 layers Cause I'm not ruling out. <laughs> I'm not ruling out that I might even get left behind from my own ship. This one's 54, also. You know what? I'll use this guy. I'll use my um my orca. But uh, I will say this: I've been using the dolphin a lot lately. 
because it's so much easier to go, you know, go in your dolphin, right, freaks? Go in your dolphin and just land literally wherever you want. It has such a small footprint. Um, you can just fly anywhere, and you don't really need it for anything else, right? <laughs> I mean, what else are you going to use a dolphin for? All right, let's go to the bar, my space bar. Look at this. This is great. Now, when I first got here, all this was very much brighter. So, um, I was really happy, but then this morning when I logged in, it's all dark now. So, who knows? But it's beautiful. Hey, look. Who's who, who's here in the, uh, in the adder? Speaking of adder, guys, are you, are you, uh, guys wondering when they're gonna add, um, freaking Apex to the game? To, to, uh, the fleet carriers? That'd be freaking great. I can't tell you how many times I've stranded myself on a planet with no way home. And when I say home, I mean back to the fleet carrier. Joe says, my fleet carrier is very far away from the bubble. Uh, on the ISO Terran Exploration Expedition. Ooh, I ran into the wall while I read, read that. Um, oh, wait. Wh I'm going to continue reading that, but watch this. Okay. So my one co I have one complaint about the game right now. I know you guys have a laundry list, but look at this. My main complaint is whenever I land somewhere in my orca, the 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 loading bubble thing there is on the other side of the orca. However, on my carrier, my orca knows to put it on this side, which is the the near side. So this thing folds open and then we we step into it. I really hope that becomes an animation one day. I hope you, you know, like this is all great and everything, right? But I'd love to go here, push E, oops, <laughs> and then that just opens up. That would be so cool. I don't care how long it takes. I walk around in my freaking fleet carrier all day long. Uh, just to do, I don't know, playing the game, I guess. Okay, all right, I digress. I'm going back to the reading of the comment. So, um, Joe is on the ISO Terran Exploration. Expedition 3 in Vulcan Gate will be out there exploring until June 3rd. Wow. Grimlu Grimulus says Dolphin is a very good exploration ship. Can jump above 60. Yes. It's it's really good. The only thing I would say that the or that the Dolphin isn't that the Orca is is speed. It's not as fast as the Orca, which is fine. It's fine. I don't mind. Now, as soon as I take off from here, I do expect to be shot at by my own stream, but tis tis the uh, um, that just the the uh, <laughs> the the perils of hosting a live stream in open and with these guys of Ghost Giraffe. Um, that's just how life is. Okay, having said that, I do hope that people brought with them um, some attack vessels, because one of these locations there's going to be a war um, I've tried to go there in peace they they blinkly defy that peace and for that we shall blow them out of the stars who who's landing in, in just the best way possible someone brought an asp I've not seen one of those since <laughs> since horizons okay where we go first location guys are you guys ready for this you guys ready for this First location. Do you guys can you already guess what it is, or have you forgotten it? Okay, this place is literally called the Hidden Osmium Drilling Site. Not only is it forgotten, it's also hidden. All right, let's go. This spot is in the rings. Now, when I say in the rings, I don't mean above the rings, slightly above. You know, some places are like, oh, cool, you got a nice view of the rings, and I don't mean like. In the rings, it's like you know, it, like a um, an asteroid base where it's in the rings, but you know you got some clearance from the asteroids. This is literally inside of <laughs> the ring asteroids. They're floating around, tickling them and everything. You'll see what I mean in just a second. All right, we're coming in here. It's gonna take forever because my fleet carrier parked way close to this gas giant, but I'm okay with that because I have patience. Okay. One minute and ten seconds. I'm, I'm, I don't think this counter is correct, but whatever. We're going. All right. Mirror Jade doesn't remember when she last logged on. I know that feeling. 
Like, where am I gonna um, log in today? Don't know. All right. Almost there. Who's who's blazing ahead of us? Martian Turtle knows how to play the game. Martian Turtle's gonna get there before we do. All right. I feel like you guys are in wing with each other. I feel like I should be in wing with you guys. I don't know. Okay, coming in. Oh, great. I got an invitation. There we go. Coming in. Whoa. Hidden osmium drilling. Now, I don't know if there's actual osmium hidden somewhere over here. But look at this. Okay, it is an installation literally inside of the rings. With all, with decorated with popcorn of all sorts. When I came here, I was like, no. No, are you serious? It's literally inside of, look, look. Okay, let me, let me slow down. Okay, going around here. This is a dangerous place to work. I right, got that thing right there. Literally, is it clipping into it? I think it, I hope they never change this. Honestly, this is, I love this. Look at that. This is fantastic. Look, the lights are so close, the lights light up the thing. The lights are lighting up the asteroids around it. That's wonderful. This is so cool. Look at this place. Okay, hold on. I'm going to go in external mode. One second. One second. Okay, which way is right side up? I suppose this side is. Oh, this is neat. What is this place? Why is this here? Why is this literally where it is? I'm happy it is. Okay, I'm going to do something. I'm going to um, put my camera on the nose of my orca. And I look up like this. Then give a bit of a wide angle here. There we go. Up, down. All right, now I can fly around. Look at this. What What a view. Wouldn't it be cool to work here? Uh-oh. What's going on? Why are shots being fired? I don't know. Oh, I'm just going to tour around here. This looks so neat. I wonder if there's any um, maintenance hatches we can go inside of. Whoa, that's a wall. I think my nose is, my camera's pointed a little bit down. That's fine. Oh my God, this place is a masterpiece. Ouch! <laughs> that hurt. Look at this. Okay, we got to figure out some kind of race or like really fun thing to do here. Because this is... This location needs like an, an official like event or function. Whoa, I'm getting some frame clipping there. That's cool. Oh, and then the backdrop of the the gas planet? I mean, this doesn't get any better. It literally does not. I set the bar too high for this stream. <laughs> the rest of the, the things are... are, are no, no I'll, I take that back. The rest of the things I have to show for to you guys for the rest of the stream are really freaking cool. But I wanted to start out strong with this place. I totally knew that asteroid was behind me. Look at that. Ouch. I knew that one was there too. I wanted to stop right then and there. Clipping though? Yes, it's clipping. But it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. I mean, shot at. 
Freaks. Okay, let's see here. Freaks has healing beams, so I can shoot Mars with love. Have you scanned the asteroids for cores? I have not. I have not scanned these asteroids. Now, this place says it's an osmium. What is this? Uh-oh. The cops are here. Guys. Guys, the cops. They're already here. Why are they here already? Does somebody not have crimes turned off? I have crimes turned off. Because I I'm a I'm a responsible live streamer. Just jump out. If you're the cops are after you, just jump out, jump back in. No problem. Martian turtle. You're getting shot at. Junk commander's here. Drunken, what do you think of this place? Oh, this is This is life. This is why I started playing this game. For scenes just like this. Okay, so I think people have chosen violence. I think they instead of jumping out and jumping back in, they've chosen just to fight the law. Oh, let me um let me data scan this place. Let's see here. Scanny, 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 industrial thing. All right. I need to do service scanner, no. Data link scanner, that's the button. There we go. Let's see what th this thing's made out of. In fact, I bet it has cargo, right? Okay. There's some cargo here. I wonder, does anybody have a uh, cargo manifest scanner? I wonder what kind of stuff it's it's holding. I have a manifest scanner. Should I go back to the uh, the the? Uh, should I bo go back and get my manifest scanner? Clipping in a good way, yeah. This is the best kind of clipping. I would give this uh, 10 out of 10 wood clip again. Okay. Since no one's going to go get manifest scan, I want to see what's inside of these cargo racks, guys. I want to see what these guys have been up to. Let's see. Who knows? Maybe there's like a new rare item in here. Also, you can maybe get pushed inside by the asteroid spin. Let's see, where's my... I put my uh, fleet carrier over here. Look at that. That's the craziest... This, this is one of the craziest things I've seen in the game. Mainly because everything's clipping into it, you know. Usually they clear out the asteroids around uh, a, a, an object like this, but this is the only one that I know of that looks like this, where things are kind of clipping into it, and I kind of like that. It kind of it adds to like it's hidden within within the uh, the rings here. But let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and get um not just a manifest scanner. Let's get a prospect scanner. Let's see if any of these things have any treasures. What ship am I using? I'm using an orca, but I'm gonna change it up. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring in. Um, I think I'm gonna bring in my uh, my python. Cause my python is rigged for for uh, um, mining. So I'm gonna do a quick wardrobe change. And then we're gonna we're gonna go back in there. I'm gonna see what this place, what else this place has in store. There's this other place called Valhalla Mobile Defense Department. That one's slightly further away than the Osmium drilling. Not further away, closer. I wonder if that's a place. I don't know. Maybe Freaks, can you go check out the Valhalla place? Let's see where that is. 
I wonder if there's more than one place in here that's inside of the rings. No, it's definitely well outside. Okay, Martian Turtle has found that it's well outside of the rings. Alright, I'm gonna land here, switch into my Python, and then we're gonna see if uh, this hidden Osmium mining facility indeed has, my, has uh, osmium, osmium in it, or if the uh, area around it has any Osmium itself. Landing, 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 landing. <laughs> That's how I land. There we go. Good chunk. Refuel. Carrier services. I have a checklist. I don't know if you guys do. Like whenever I land, I refuel, repair, whatever. I go. I check that I have anything. No. I go to advanced maintenance. I pay for it. I always do that before I do anything else. Let's see. I'm just wacky. Okay, um, here we go. Fire Death Storm. I've named my Python Fire Death Storm to deter would-be attackers. I feel like, and with a name like that, it has to be true. Like, um, there's no way that somebody with a uh, a ship with so much grammatical errors would not contain just bunches of fire and death and storming upon one. This place is anarchy, though. Says somebody. Alright. What do I need? I need to make sure I have a manifest scanner. Because we're going to see if that thing has any manifest. Do I need a point defense? Probably. Shield booster? Not today. Manifest scanner. What about this one? Is this, is this a fast scanner? Alright, let's do this. Equip module. And then... And here, I have detailed surface scanner, prospect. Okay, that's all good. Um, I don't have any collectors. Let's see. Collected limpets. Uh, lightweight. This one's a little bit more lightweight. Oh, this one's a five. I'll use this one. Equip that. And then this one, I'll do this a hatch breaker. Hatchbreaker limpets. Now, guys, do you remember for hatch breaking? Did they change it? Do you need to use a recon node or whatever it is, Can, or do I just use the hatchbreaker? Like I scan the whole thing, and then after that, I I uh, select the module on the on the cargo bay, and then I shoot the hatchbreaker at it. Is that how it works, or have they changed it? Okay, then other than that, I think I'm ready to go. Okay, people are telling me stuff in here. Data link and hatch break. No recon needed. Okay, good. My carrier does have restock. It should. It, it literally has everything. Look, I even installed this secure trading. I don't know what it does, but I have it now. It's mine. Um, also, I really like this background. I um, I have other backgrounds. Like you can change the background. <laughs> I mean, it says I'm a smuggler, but I just chose I just chose it for the background. I also like um, the explorer one. The explorer one looks pretty cool too, like that. But um, just to look kind of fun, menacing, I like putting the smuggler one. I mean, having said that, I do a lot of smuggling. Oops. So maybe I am a smuggler. I don't know. But today we're, we're explorers. Okay, I think I have everything I need. Let's see. Maybe reinstall it, says Frakes. If it's not grayed out, it's bugged. Okay, should I... Not, I'm not going to reinstall it. I'll like um. I'll suspend services and then put it back. Let's see. See refuel repair. Okay, I'm going to suspend, suspend, suspend. Okay, now I'm going to resume service, resume service, resume service. Does that work out for you guys? So much. 
Okay, now I also need to get limpets. Limpets. Let's get all the limpets. All of them. How many? All. I wish there was a button for that. Okay. I'll do I'll do less than all actually. Conform. Alright, let's see what this hidden base has in store for us guys. Hey Scott from Bangkok. How you doing? Okay, we're getting back in there. Real explorers don't do combat. We don't? <laughs> oh no. You know, I explore, but I don't explore the bubble, because that's all I have patience for. I mean, somebody's got to do it, right? What the hell was that? What the hell was what? Oh, somebody's shooting at me with a cannon. Got pinned down by an asteroid and almost clipped. I'm being squashed by the rock into the station. Oh yay, people on the stream are already dying to our location. Fantastic. I think our uh, we're definitely going to hit the Ghost Draft bingo card today. It's 10 p.m. over there. I'm a bu bubble bunny. Yes, I just hop around the bubble. Speaking of which, I think my carrier, th just this week, um, I think I've done 27 jumps since Thursday. Just hopping around, just having fun. I saw somebody posted that they hopped around. They did uh, 87. Um, and I think that was just that day. That's impossible. There must have been a week, a week long of hopping around. Okay, but uh, it's not that hard to reload your your carrier. You just um, write down which stations most likely have uh, tritium, and just buy some gallons over there, and then fill a rack up. It's about fifty million to refuel, refuel, but uh, do a trade route, do a couple trade routes, and then you got all that paid for, and then some. Oh no, this doesn't have. Okay, I'm gonna have to, have to go in manually. I always use Super Cruise Assist. Oh wait, I forgot. That's <laughs> that's a function too. Oh my God. Okay, we're here. If you guys missed it at the beginning of the stream, now we're here. Check this place out. Look at this place. Oh my god. This place is so cool. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to manifest scan the uh, the cargo base. So whatever you guys do, don't shoot it. Because I think that might reset the cargo base. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, surface scanner, no. I should I probably should have surface scanned these rings. Manifest scanner, no. No, don't need that. Okay, let's just make a whole new thing. Data leak scanner, yes. Then manifest scanner next. Okay. Data leak scanning. Scanny scanny. Scanny scanny. I love that in my, that grid animation that's so fun okay we did that all right now let's go see what's inside of their cargo base this place is called hidden osmium drilling I see a, a the lack of drilling is disturbing okay where is this cargo bay let's see if they have some osmium inside or maybe this is just a front for something else that they do. Something else nefarious. All together. Add a fast scanner. Okay. Alright, I wonder if this place has cannons. Okay. Time to scan. Manifest. What do you have inside? Cargo Bay Zero. Cargo Bay Zero has... Cargo Bay Zero has. The hell's going on? Am I doing this incorrectly? Okay. 
data scan it first, okay. Because that makes sense. Okay, I data leak scanned it. Okay, limpet doc point. I'm just gonna s manifest scan it. There we go. Okay, target. Okay, here we go. It has inside some coffee, beer, and tea. Okay, so this is this is their cafeteria. Let's go. <laughs> We're at the wrong loading bay. Let's go to cargo bay one. Let's go to cargo bay one. Cargo bay one's on the other side. All right. Where is their osmium? Where is this osmium I've heard tell about? Oh, so nice flying the the python. Okay, as I lear we learned from last time, we data link scan it, and then you manifest scan. I literally have a video on how to do this, and I've forgotten it. Okay, and in here. Coffee, beer, and tea. What the hell is this? Starbucks? Okay. Okay, so... It must be... It must be in Cargo Bay 2 then. All their Osmium, for sure. Without fail. Is here. Aeroflot says they're here. F fantastic. Okay. All right, let's see what's over here. Oh my god, there's a giant rock right here. Okay. It's fine. Let's see. Scanned it. Now manifest scanning. Come on, Osmium. It's the whole reason you're here. What's inside, guys? Are you ready for it? Coffee, beer, and tea. Well, guess what? All that's going to be mine now. I'm going to take all their coffee and beer. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to use... A hatchbreaker. Can you believe it? Okay. Guys, I'm going to do a very... Be careful. Because I'm going to hatchbreak this. There might be bad times. Let's find out. Oh wait, where's the button? Hatchbreaker? Hatchbreaker, there it is. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Cargo dropped. Cargo dropped. Okay, let's pick up the stuff. Hatchbreaker collector. There it is. Let's pick up the stuff. Pick up the stuff. Cargo down. All right, cover me, guys. I'm I'm taking all their coffee, their tea, and their beer. Okay, drunken commander wants to just destroy everything. He wants just to destroy them. He's he's even crazier than I am. I wanted to steal all their stuff. But no. <laughs> or is that Martian Turtle? Did I get any of it? I've got nothing. Collectors. Come on, collectors. Go pick up stuff. Oh, you know what? Here we go. Remove beer from do not take list. I want tea. I want coffee. Give me it all. Okay, incoming missile. Block me with your bodies, everybody. Block me with your bodies. Protect the python as I steal all this very menial stuff. I'm gonna fly into that thing there. Let's avoid that. There we go, there we go. Oh no, somebody, they're just running into the cargo. They don't want me to have these things. <laughs> I'm being shot at now. I can't tell by who. I think by my own people. Oh, no. I'm dead. Alright, guys. I guess that's it for this place. Now to, ne to the next place. Killed by Frakes. What a surprise.
I'd rather you you have used silent running to avoid detection from the turret and system authority ships. The thing is, now Red Wing Pixie, you and I have uh, very similar thinking, and I was thinking the exact same thing. The problem is, is that I forgot that I rebound my uh, um, silent running to something very not, much not what I thought it was. I thought I had silent running on my um, joystick, but it was not. It was to my keyboard. And uh, so when I pressed it, nothing happened. Okay, next spot. <laughs> so then, then, then I then I remembered. Okay, it's it's on my keyboard. I know. I'll I'll go ahead and um, run silent running now. But by then it was too late, and my shields were off. And then it didn't matter because my own stream killed me. But now I think they're I think they were saying they were done with that place. They didn't want to. They don't want to go there anymore. They had all their fun where that was. So we'll go to the next spot. Let's go to the next spot. Let me make it really, really far. So that way people are like, oh no. Okay, let me go to my list. So also another reason why all this is um, happening is that um, I'm doing a bit of a spring cleaning of my uh, bookmarks here on the galaxy map. And I realize I have all these bookmarks of places and I don't know where they are, what they are. Um, I don't know what they, there's no notes, right? There's no notes as to what these things do. I mean, I'm glad that it's sort of, kind of organized, right? Sort of, not really. Um, I really wish there was, okay, you have things for bodies, stations, and settlements, and that kind of thing. But I would like to have folders where I'd be like, um, cool this or cool that or whatever, right? Because the way I have it set up in my thing, I have them with a little, like an exclamation mark. These are for like science stuff. So they're organized this way. Then for stuff that um, are special to me, uh, I have hashtag. So that way all of these guys are all together. Then I have the uh, percentage signs for places I want to go to and maybe I have not been there yet. All right. And then I have, I had some other ones, that things that we've done on stream or um, in a, uh, not in stream, but uh, for videos and stuff like that. Okay, so carrier mode. Where where do we want to send the carrier? We want to send the carrier out this way. We want to go to this place, and there's a very special place here. Uh, there we go, and we want to go here, or is it here? Let me check. There's a couple places here we want to go to. Okay, one of the places we want to go to is definitely here because this right here, this ring world here, is atmospheric and has rings around it. That's pretty cool. However, the place that we really want to go to, look at, look at all these places. All these places are really cool. They're all landable. I think it's here, though. No matter. We'll just go here and it doesn't matter because we'll be all in system. We'll get set carry to there. Alright. And then, let's see here. Going to invite Martian Turtle back. Martian Turtle, you're, you're in solo for some reason. I'm going to go ahead and launch. You should supp I should uh, explore the abyss and solitude void. Is that a place? Is that an actual place I can go to? No kind of commodities does it sell. All right, so we're just gonna fly there because it's not it's like, it's not too far from where I am. Care is gonna get there in a little bit. Okay, carry. I wonder if we can race the carrier there. Drake no. right. says, "Stand, stand." I don't know what that means. 
Oh, everyone's standing. Everyone's in the fleet carrier. I'll race you guys there. Okay, this next spot. Do you guys know what's here? I wonder if you guys saw it enough time on uh, the destination chart. Let's see here. Now this next spot has its own own quirks in that uh, it's um, both really cool and really really bugged. I don't know. I mean the last spot you saw where we were the uh, Osmium Milling uh, Mining Society or whatever it was called uh, they had asteroids kind of inside of it and floating around this place has sort of the opposite problem where it's not just in the rings but it's in its it's created its own gap in the rings now there's gonna be a bit of a challenge getting inside of it um, you'll see what I mean but if you guys remember um, our last space tourism episode it's a little bit like that except for it's a different place there we go and wad wait do I have enough gas okay on principle I fly without a fuel scoop so I think okay I'll make it there I think I think I'll just make it there Yeah, Rome Chrome. I think it was called the Osmium Beer, Coffee, and Tea Facility. <laughs> I think it was called the the Osmium uh, uh, Kiosk, Coffee Kiosk. God, no wonder they keep that hidden. They don't want people to know that. It, it's just it's a front. It's like um, it's a money pit. It's like, what do you guys do? Oh, I mine Moz Osmium. Sure. Oh yeah. Um. Can we see the books? Nah, man. It's just... It's hidden. Okay, Martian Turtle made it back. Alright. Guys, if you're on the carrier, get into a ship that has uh, fighters. Ship launch fighters. Uh, I'll explain more once we get there, but make sure you have a ship that has uh, fighters because the, the, I think the fighters might be the only way we're going to get to where this place is we will see it for certain and you will be like wow what a place I see why nobody comes here <laughs> but it's really cool it's really neat and I've I had fun last night interacting with it Frake says ain't got no faders here um, there is a station where we're going so if you have the restock bug or if you don't have a fighter and you need to maybe install one in one of your ships, there is a station at the place we're going. Watch out, there's a star here. I noticed there's like stars everywhere here. I've been running into them like crazy. Martian Turtle says my ship my ship is a fighter. Well the problem is unless you mean you're flying a keelback and you're using it like a Jedi uh, fighter. Where you just use a keel back for uh, hyper jumps. I don't think there is a way. Okay, all of you. Okay, I'm not gonna explain it. Fine, come in your. <laughs> don't bring a fighter. Come in your own ships, and and you try to go to where this place is, and you be the fighters you have meant to be, and we'll see who gets there, and who um, and, and then what happens. All right going in there so we're going to the second location first location really cool I think I think 10 out of 10 that place was fantastic best place to get your tea I swear to God if there's ever a CG where you need tea beer and and uh, coffee I'm going there I'm freaking logging off logging back in like 24 7 just you know hitting all the cargo bays no one can stop me. They're gonna have to like nerf it. They're gonna have to like actually put Osmium in there because um, I'm gonna be set. Okay, we're almost there. Now it's funny because I said if you get left behind, make sure you have a, a ship that does at least 25 light year jumps. But here I am in a Python doing less than that. Oh, you know what I should have done? I'm so silly. I'll do it now. I'll do it now. I'm one jump away, but 
Doesn't matter. I should have. Oh no, my inventory is empty. Never mind. Wait, how much jump range does this have? 30. I'm fine. I listen to my own rules. Okay, so final destination here. HIP 33368. That's HIP 33368. Go today. That's what that sounded like. Is there a list of hidden places somewhere? I will put in the comments after the stream is done all the places we went to today. I should have done that earlier. I should have put that in the description. In fact, I'll do both. When this comes out as a video, I will put in the in the description and the comments um, where to go. All right. So where did I send? <laughs> I like this this uh this fit carrier. Totally agreeable name. Okay. Where are we going? Let's see here. Did I send the? Did I send it to the right? There it is. There's the. Uh, that's where it's going to be. Okay, guys, are, is, the, uh, is the fleet carrier almost there? I beat you guys. Martian turtle has dropped out of the wing again. Somehow I beat my fleet carrier to my own place. Let's see. So I put that there. Where we are going, somewhere else, however. Where we are going is this place. Two. That's fine. There's multiple places I want to go here anyway. Um, but we'll start with the destination. Okay, coming in here. Seven minutes to jump, says Joshua De La Fuente. Fantastic. Okay, in that case, in that case, let's go here. Oh look, there's a uh, this fighting here. That's cool. I want to go here just while we're waiting for the our friends to come. Let's go there. He says without checking how much fuel he has left. Also, I've, have you guys noticed whenever you want to cancel your um, carrier from jumping, it doesn't. Like sometimes I send um, a carrier to somewhere and then I realize, oh wait, I forgot to tell it where in the system to go. Look at that, it's got that free floating stuff over there. Um, and tried to cancel and it won't do it. Look at those things, they're, just, they're not even orbiting anything, they're just like in Lagrange points. Interesting. I haven't seen that often enough. Okay, well first we're going to head out to this place because it has a cool atmosphere. And then when, once the carrier gets here, I'm going to switch into a ship that has fighters in it. And there's a reason for that. You'll see once once we get to where we're going. Um, this system has lots of crazy stuff in it anyway. Like, number one, the place where we're going to go. But two, it's got this cool landable place here, a cool landable ring place. And then this cool landable ring place. Um that uh, has atmosphere so we're just going to check that out real fast then we'll go we'll go to where we're going dude your fuel my fuel is fine actually my fuel is 100 percent full it's full see if you take out that e well you get the e and you break off the uh the other bits of the e it says full Fuel full. <laughs> My dad told me that one time. He, uh, I said, Dad, we're we're out of fuel, we're, and he goes, No, we're not. And he put his finger, his pinky finger, over the E. As a C, it says full. And I laughed so hard. And then we died. All right. Let's see here. No, my dad. He had. We ran out of fuel so many times in that truck that he just bought. Um, a kid's bike, not for me. No, it was for the truck. He put the bought a kid's bike so that way he could bike to the nearest um, gas station, and then come back with it. Come back with the fuel. He basically bought um, a fighter that he could use to uh, pick up 
um, hydrogen gas to put in, into his into his uh, his kill back. That's basically what it amounts to. Oh, it's fun. Those are fun times. Oh, look at this. This is a cool, nice um, inclination this place has. I wonder if we'll be able to see the rings of that place. No, it's kind of dim over there. But over here, let's see. Let's see if these rings are dim or not. They look it. I say that. But I cannot see. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Honda from 80s came with its own bike in the truck. What? How old are you, Martian Turtle? Look at this. This isn't where we're going, but this is where we are. Hold on. I want to look at this place. What else is here? Natural logistical analysis? What is that? Is that, is that above the rings? Not interested. Yes, that's going to be the theme of this stream. If it's not, if it's not in the rings, not interested. Having said that, we are going here because it has an atmosphere, and uh, I just want to see what this looks like. This could look really neat. Looks like nice blue skies. Looks like everybody has arrived in system. Are you guys have you guys arrived? Arrive alive. You guys are standing? Fantastic. Nobody got left behind? Also, there is a thing where my carrier leaves people behind. It is by design. This is pretty. It's a giant McDonald's like art arches here. Beautiful. Oh, coming in. This is another reason why I like using uh, a, a dolphin. I am well aware I am not in a dolphin. But like I said in the start of the stream, I usually fly around in a dolphin. Because you can land that thing anywhere. There was this giant mountain. I say mountain. It was really just a pencil about 20 miles high and I was able to land on it uh, at the very peak of it because I was in a dolphin. A dolphin parking only. Oh, this place is cool. I didn't know this was here though. So I'm kind of glad, in a way, I'm glad I came here the equivalent to walking when you have a fleet carrier. That's pretty. That is pretty. All right. Well, that's enough uh, sightseeing. Let's go let's go look at what we came here for. All right. Guys, get ready. I'm about to go into super cruise. Also, I'm going to tell you where to go. Yeah, DBXs are fantastic. They're beautiful. They have great jump ranges. The only thing I would say DBX, I like having two um, SRV containers. And uh, in case I blow one up accidentally. And I feel like DBX, the, the optional internals are a little bit lacking. Where is this place? Alright, oh there it is. Okay. Here it is. 
Oh, it looks like <laughs> it looks like everybody in my wing uh, had a, uh, a a successful jaunt to where we are now. All right, now we're headed to Skullmore Keep. This is a military zone. Watch out! Now, this military zone, um, it is very, very tricky. I don't. I'm not sure how to explain what this place is. I will say what it looks like. Now, when you go there, there's a ringed planet, surrounded by rings, as the ringed planets are. And in the rings, there's like a gap. And in that gap is this place called Skullmore Keep. Now, if you try to go to it, you will fail. <laughs> but when you see it, you'll you'll be like, oh, wow, what a cool thing. Um, so we're going to try to figure out how to get to it because you can't get to it. That's why I wanted everybody to bring fighters because I think there's a way using fighters to get to it. I'm being very vague because I don't want to give away what this thing is doing in the rings. But it's really, 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 really cool. Okay. Coming in. Is there another ring planet here? I think so. Turtles ahead of me. Skullmore keep. Alright. Alright, guys. Get ready. If you guys are playing the game right now, or you guys are like at work, or paying attention in, in school, stop. Because you don't want to miss this when you first come in here. What is up with that place? Why is it like that? This this is a wacky system. Like everything's um, orbital inclination is like totally off, and then everything like kind of revolves around itself. Like uh, hardly anything. This is like a a, uh, a system of introvert planets. Things only revolve around themselves and not the main star. Skullmore Keep Planet Two. Electric Boogaloo. Was oh, a military thing in So Song that it's impossible to catch? Really? I did not know that. I'll have to investigate. Okay, so we're going to the star apparently. I didn't realize this was a star over here. Okay. Hope Eagle is good enough. It will not be. Hello, Rory the space person. Oh my god. There's another planet, like, real close by, too. Okay. Turn around. Okay, here we go. Skullmore Keep. Why do the rings look like that? Okay, here we go. I'm gonna turn on night vision. And I'm gonna go over here. The rings look so bad. Let's go. <laughs> Let's get it here. Skull more keep. There he goes. Here we go. Come in. I think it's this way. There's a certain direction you need to come at it. At. It's in the nighttime side, which doesn't help our, our cause here. Okay. Almost there. Almost there. Dropping in now. Okay. Where is it? 600 kilometers away. Six 
605 kilometers away. 604 kilometers away. Okay, I need to get a little bit closer, apparently. Is this the lair of a super villain? It kind of is. It kind of feels that way. There we go. There we go. Alright. Skull more keep. It appears to, appears to be going away from us. That's right. <laughs> that is right. Okay, let's go in front of it. Okay, Lagrac. The crack, uh, 27. Figured it out. Figured out what it is. We cannot see it, but it is. All right. Okay, drop here. All right, come here, the crack. Not the crack. Come here, station. There you are. There it is. I'm going towards it. I'm going towards it. There it is. You can see it on the screen. It's going freaking fast. And there it goes. Okay, there's a way to catch up with it. And it involves fighters. Which is why I told everybody to bring a fighter. And of course, what does everybody do? Not bring fighters. Alright. Another thing to do to catch up with this thing is approach it on the left. Okay, here we go. Right there. Scum or keep. Okay, it's it's staying still. Alright, I gotta stay still. It's ninety-four kilometers away, but it's not moving. The position of the nav point and the station target are way off from each other. Okay. I'm in a python. Yes, freaks, I'm in a python, because somebody exploded me before I could get into a real ship. Freaks. I wonder why I'm in a python, freaks. Mm -hmm. I heal lasers. You tried to heal me with lasers when I had no shields on. Okay, I can catch up now. I'm almost there. 74 kilometers away. So, we are somehow in the rings here. I don't see the rings, but we are in the rings here. It's very unfortunate this is in nighttime. But it'll be daytime soon. Yes, they, they very much damage you. If you remember from um, the episode where I tried to heal S Sparks' ship with my heal lasers. Well, when his uh, ship was off, that's how he died. And I'm pretty sure if you have me targeted, Freaks, you can see that my hit points are going down as you're firing at me. Okay. Almost there, 55 kilometers away. Joshua De La Frente, wait. Where is this orbiting? <laughs> okay, you found it. Yes, it's exactly like the one in So Song, Le Crack. But I'm not sure. This one might be. Okay, I've been able to keep it from moving. It's right in front of me. I know it doesn't look like it, but it is right in front of me. It's right there. Now, NPC ships, for some reason, aren't affected by it. If you go too far away, there it goes. It's, starting to, it's coming up on, this, on the view screen now. This is a lot more fun if this was in daytime. Okay, I need to slow down. Okay, don't impulse attack me because the problem is th so Skullmore Keep is attached to the rings that are behind us. If this were daytime, you could see the uh, rings over there and those guys, they're not that far. And they're whizzing by like a freaking uh, NASCAR speed event. Okay, Martian Turtle, we're about to say goodbye to Martian Turtle in just a second. Let's watch Martian Turtle as he disappears into the unknown. Um... So, like I said, Skullmore Keep is attached to the rings behind us. At a certain point, I think like right in, f right in the middle or so, Skullmore Keep then becomes that rings, the rings over there? Question mark? I don't know. Um, 
and then you get uh, you get yeeted out of out of the instance. Let's see here. Let's get a little it's inch closer. So NPC ships can fly wherever they want with impunity to this place, but I, as a ship, I cannot. Okay, a lot of ships are either jumping or jumping out. Okay, gonna get close. So I w what I want to test, I want to see if I can get to here using a fighter instead of a main ship. Because I've used my, if I use my main ship to try to get to it, I get pulled out. Okay, there's some NPC ships here. Now don't let those guys fool you. They aren't actually here. Look at these guys jumping in. Now this is another thing that happens here. Is that ships jump in like crazy. Okay, this is about as close. Oh, dang it. There it goes. Okay. It ran away. <laughs> it saw me. Okay, let's go ca catch up with it. Okay. And jump it, drop it out, drop it, drop it, drop it. There we go. Alright, cool. I caught up with it. Okay, Frakes is here. <laughs> Frakes made it too. That was cool seeing you jump in here. But I think um, the NPCs are dropping in, dropping out like crazy because I think they're getting left behind too. Look at that. Oh, there goes one right now. That might have been a player. No, that was an NPC. Oh, hilarious. Now there's going to be a, uh, a scenario here. I can't wait to see this. Hold on. Let's get a little bit closer. My fuel tank is low. Alright. Okay, look at... <laughs> okay, this is funny. So, look at the NPCs. Look at them fighting. But look at that. They get all washed away. In the current. Okay, look at these guys. And then you'll you'll see them you'll see them fighting, but then the uh, the heavy current just pulls them off. Like these guys over here, watch. These are these guys are about to go. And they're gone. There they go. So I think it, it behooves us to join the Skullmore Keep faction. Because no matter how many pirates come in here, they're just going to get pulled off. Okay, don't get within 10 kilometers of the keep. That's I think that's the dead zone. I think I just got into 9 kilometers to the keep, and then bad things happened. Okay. I wonder what the speed this thing is traveling at is. Okay, look at all these guys. See, the, the battle... The battle just keeps drifting away. There goes that guy. Oh man, they and they go by fast too. Oh, there goes that guy. <laughs> yeah, so NPCs are affected by this. So that's why I'm curious. I my guess is that if I came here with a fighter, that uh my fighter would get pulled away from it and then I would explode because then I had reached the maximum distance I could be from my mothership. That's my That's my theory. But I want I want somebody to try it out. And I also want it to be daylight soon because it's really fun to see there's a rings behind this. And it would be really fun to see them uh zooming by as fast as they do zoom by. Now it's all I can't tell if it's almost daytime or almost nighttime, or in the middle of the night. Let's try to get close by just using this. Okay, it's about as close as we can get. But look at that! Look at that battle over here. How are these guys still in the instance? I wonder. I mean, they are glitching out a bit. You can. It might not show up so much in YouTube, but there's. I can look. I can literally see an anaconda. And it's rubber banding like crazy. Let's look at these guys. Okay, there's somebody there. Are they going to get pulled out? 
going down. Another thing that would be good to do is is go to this place in Horizons and see if we're if we have the same issue too. Another thing about good about doing this in Horizons is that um, you can. Uh, I was gonna say, you can uh, go into the external camera, but retain your night vision. But you can't do that in Odyssey. They fixed it. I say fixed with quotation marks, because I think it'd be cool. So I can slam at an asteroid at god speed. You could, if um, the only problem is by before you can even get to the asteroids on the other side of this thing. Um, you're already left behind. So you're going as fast as the asteroids over there. However, I think the asteroids behind you are then zipping around at a million miles per hour. Oh, we could do that. Okay. As soon as it's daytime here. Okay, let me go get bring a fighter. Oh, let me just see what's the uh, what's the limit here. 10 kilometers, 9 kilometers, 8, 7. This is the closest I've ever gotten. 6. Five. I'm here. Four. There it goes. Four kilometers. And, and it zips off like a Star Wars hyperspace jump. Alright, I'm going to go get a fighter then. How am I keeping up with this thing? So Joshua, what you need to do is come in on the near side ring. Let's see here. What time of day are we in here? Okay, we're almost to the daytime. We're almost to the daytime zone. So it's in this gap here. See that gap right there? It's in there. Approach from the left side. If you, because it's tied to the ring on the left side, not the ring on the right side. So that's how I get there. Let's go back. I'm going to go get... Let me see. Which ship should I bring? Hmm. Should I bring my kill back? I should bring the kill back. No, I shouldn't bring the kill back. Yes. <laughs> I can't decide which ship launch fighter thing should I bring. I feel like I should bring. Um, you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna bring the t Type Ten. Why? Because I uh, also want to participate in the uh, little battle that's going on over here. Look at this planet. What's its deal? Look at that. Goy rings. These random planets. They don't even have like... They're just revolving around themselves. They don't have... They're not orbiting the star. Like these guys just to themselves. These guys just to themselves. These guys are just to themselves. <laughs> this one thinks it's a star. This is like the most rebel system I've been to. Now, I'd love to visit... The facility in Sosong, because I—that's first I've heard of that one. Okay, John Arbuckle has something to say. Hey, Jeff, saw you were live, so I hopped in my ship and jumped over. On Horizons, though, I guess Audi aren't cross lobbies. No, they're not cross lobbies, unfortunately. But you can get to all these locations in Horizons. Everywhere we're going, unless it's on a planet that I—I I, I happen to do like a little sidetrack. It's all Horizons and Odyssey stuff. Um, let's see, how did I get my Python to 50, 30 light year jumping? Not just that, friend. 30 light year jumping and with all these things. Pulse lasers, collectors, all that kind of stuff. How did I do it? Let's see. Um, prismatic shield generator 4A. Let's see. Well, number one, I got, um, I think what it is, is, uh, no, I was going to say it's a Guardian booster, but I don't have one on here. That's weird. I guess it's just my frameshift drive. 
Oops. Let's see, show info. Let's see. Jeez, and it's not even full form yet. Look, it's grade four, but it has mass manager. That's great. I I literally don't know. Okay, another thing, I do have my sensors. Let's see. Or lightweight, but that can be even better. The mass is only two tons, so it maybe it doesn't even need it. What about what about this? Lightweight scanner, that helps. Honestly, that's a good question. I don't know. But um it's not too hard. Uh, if you just saw what I saw, <laughs> what I saw, it, it's just grade four FS, FSD, and um, and then also the mass manager. It's silly that the rings are like this. I said that, but it's also kind of cool. Whoa! It's like Tron. Look at this. These are some cool rings. You ever approach somewhere and you think, my god, I hope this is on this side of the planet and not the other side. But I think at this point it would have told me. Okay, I think we've had some success. I'm reading stuff in the chat. Let's see. I've managed to take the installation to hit me. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Joshua says they crashed into me. Okay. This is my mining vessel. I use this as a mining vessel instead of like a um, a cutter or something with a larger cargo rack because I usually just deposit everything at my fleet carrier. I like the uh, handling of the Python over a cutter or a Type 10 or whatever whatever have you. And so, and then also, I'm, I'm only like mining like just 200 amounts of stuff at a time. I can't, I can't do it where like I mine everything all day long. Okay, let's get into a fighter and let's try to, let's try to get to this place. Type 10. Type 10 is my favorite ship. I use it for literally everything. Fighting, mining, exploring. If it has an ing at the end of it, I do that. And key, let's, <laughs> let's make sure we have a, a fighter bay installed on it. Let's see. Oh, thank you, John Arbuckle. That's that's so nice. You wanted to thank me in person. Uh, as a, as only having two months in the game, your videos really helped me get started. Oh, that's man, that really makes me smile. Thank you so much for that. Really, really nice comment. Stuff like that really um really gets us excited to keep on finding more stuff like this, more cool things. All right. Speaking of cool things, can I? No, it only has these. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'll go with this. All right, guys, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm gonna get there using a fighter. Skullmore Keep. What a cool name. It even feels like it's a Bond villain place. Martian running away. Okay. You know, I'm not even joking. I think it'll be faster for me to get there if I jump to another system and come back. Because the time it takes to get out of this gravity well. And by the time it takes for me to then fly across over there, I think it's faster for me to jump out and jump back in. Because it's only planet 2. Yeah. Yeah, it's way faster if I jump out and I come back and it's planet 2. It's right right back at the star. Uh-oh. There goes everything. The game saw that I had a great idea and decided to be like, no, you're going to walk. <laughs> you're walking, buddy. That happens to me, though. Whenever I go somewhere in a, in a fleet carrier, 
and then I jump somewhere, I get the black adder thing. I should probably report it. If only there were a way to let people, <laughs> let the game designers know. Alright. We were going here. Okay, you guys are going to have to invite me back into the wing. Okay, so people have had the station crash into them. Let's see, have I built a missile boat T10 like yours? No, I have not. Although I do have, uh, with the pack hounds, yeah, the spaghetti launchers. Although I do have um, the pack hounds to do it. I just have not done it myself. Okay, now I'm going back. Whenever I go back into... um. Horizons. I forget that you don't just hold down click <laughs> to uh, plot your course. So I'll go to the galaxy map and I'll like click on a star, and I'm like, I'm holding down click. How come this is not working? What's going on? Why is this not? Us? Oh yeah, I forgot. I'm in, I'm in Horizons. Okay, guys, when you've had the station run into you, does it do lots of damage? Or are you guys okay with it? And also, does it run into you and then glitch past you? Or does it push you along with it? Skull Markeep. Oh yes, it has Super Cruise Assist. It glitches past and does a little damage. Okay, here we go. See, I told you, it was a lot faster to just jump out jump back in. It's right there. Hopefully it's in daylight now. Coming in. Martian turtle has died. All right, guys, you're gonna see it now in its full glory. Okay, like I said before, whatever you're doing, don't do this. <laughs> Watch this. Okay, it's in it's in daylight. Don't need forgetting anything. I'm coming in way too fast. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, I see the lane. It's right here. All right. Okay. If I come in just right about here, I think it can run into me. Run into me, but I I stay with it. Is what I mean. No, 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 I can do this. I can do this. I'm turning off my nav computer. Okay. I'm going to make it jump to me, guys. Watch this. First try. It's not even going to run into me. I have no problem. Okay. Coming in. Skullmark keep. Wing, please. Somebody send him a wing. Okay, it's just around the bend. What are these triangles? Okay, I'm going to jump in at about a kilometer away. Not a kilometer, but something less than that. Okay. Okay, it's coming. Driving close. As you can see, guys, on the on your right, Um, there is stuff, but on the left, see the stuff is moving. I'm gonna go to the to the left, and I'm gonna join this ring. And once I join this ring, that on that side will start coming at me. But then the strategy is, I'm gonna ride these rings to that, and then once I get close enough, I'm gonna jump back to the other side. And it's totally gonna work. <laughs> it's totally gonna work, right? Alright. Marsh Turtle has died again. Okay, let me just jump to it again, actually. Hold on. 
instead of wasting everybody's time. Between the rings here in Super Cruise, flying back up and out, joining this ring. All right, Let's see here it is. There we go. Whoa, I'm upside down. Why am I upside down? Okay, I'm here. Okay, we're floating with it. We're floating with it now. I'm going to external. Okay, as you can see, the, the it's a cool planet over there, and the rings are moving right past us. There's a battle going over here, and NPCs are going <laughs> the whole way. They're getting left behind. See you later, battle. Have fun in the rings. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is glorious. This is everything I wanted it to be. Coming up. Oh, I didn't realize there, there would be a scenario here. And they're just getting yeeted away. They're trying. They're like rubber banding. They're like on a yo-yo string. Then behind us, there's, these rocks are just fine. No problem. Nice view too. But those rocks are going right past us. Now, once we... Um, Okay, I'm going to try to get close to this with the fighter. Alright. Oh, look at this. Our reputation has increased with this place. I'm going to get. I'm going to venture closer to this thing. And then I'm going to launch a fighter. And see if I can get to it with the fighter. Or see if the fighter gets pulled away. Alright. I don't want to get too close. I was able to get within like f six kilometers last time. I'll leave my ship about around 10 kilometers away from it. I just want to get a, a better angle at this. Okay. okay. This is good. This is good enough. Right here. Let me just take a scope at a scope at the place again. There you go. <laughs> there they go. <laughs> All the NPCs that are jumping in to take part in this uh, scenario are just getting yeeted away. Okay, this guy's struggling. He wants to stay here. Oh, he wants to stay here so bad. He's like, no, my reputation. No. There they go. Bye, fellas. Okay, this guy. This guy's gonna have. This guy's day is not gonna turn out how he planned it would. See how close he gets. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> okay, these guys are. These guys arrived. They're like, "Hey guys, we're here to help. No problem." What seems to be the problem, fellas? How come everyone's slowly drifting off to the left? Oh, I, I kind of wish though. I kind of wish that um, this place was a little bit more attainable. Because it's kind of neat just to see the, the rocks as they zip by like that. So many ships just continually jumping in. Because everyone is just getting pulled out of it. Look at those there those guys go. Look at all these wakes. Oh my god, this could be the most excellent place to Oh no, they're wake they're jumping in, not so much. Let's see, what do the uh contacts say? High wake, high wake, high wake. 
Oh, they're all over there though. They're 64 kilometers away. Alright guys, let's get into our fighters. Let's see if we can get there close enough. Okay. Okay, tell your mothership to stay in position, by the way. <laughs> Make sure it doesn't follow us into... Oh my god. Look at this. Look at those guys. They're, they're still battling it out over there. Alright. Alright, Freaks, you ready? Let's go in there. Look at them. It's, it's definitely like a high current. Like it's the uh, the Australian Pacific Current. Just like pulling everything away. Well, I want to see all these guys get just pulled away. It'll happen soon enough. Who's firing? Are we, are we fighting people? Whose ship is that? Well, not my ship. Okay, Frakes, let's get in there. Where are you? I don't see any of my friends on the view screen. Okay, I'm going in. How close am I to this location? I can't tell. It won't let me know. I'm going to come to it. Actually, I should go to it on this side. Okay. Oh, there it goes. Okay, so I do get left behind. However, my ship. Where does my ship get left? Does my ship get here too? Okay, so my ship gets uh, left behind here. So my ship gets uh, pulled with me. Okay, Martian got an incident. We won. <laughs> Settlement defended. Okay, I'm in local chat, by the way. Okay, let me switch back into my main ship here. Back to my ship. There we go. Weirdo Shrine likes socks, says they in the chat. And with good reason. Alright, can we fly to these rings? Is that a thing we can do in game? You know what? Why don't I take a, a, uh, a faster ship and find out? Now usually when you're out of sync with rings, they uh Yep, there we go. Now we're in sync with them, now they've stopped. And the rings behind us are now the ones moving. There they go. Beautiful sight. Ah. Uh, Alright guys, I think we should go to the next spot. Now the next spot you'll definitely need a um, a combat vessel. Next spot's very very dangerous if uh, you don't have one. Um, but it's also a spot that's a lot less bugged than this place. Let's see, let's go back to the mothership. Quest talking, no options, just switch. Okay, everybody, back to the carrier. I am going to lay in the course for the next spot on our tour of hidden and forgotten places in the bubble. I think when Odyssey came out, everybody just forgot that all these places existed. Okay, I'm going to tab out. Number three is this place. There we go. And 
I'll give I'll give um see if anybody can know okay we're going to this place here does anybody know what's here Has anybody heard of this place before? Okay, which planet is it at? Let's see, does my thing tell me? It doesn't. But I think it doesn't matter because I think these two are tied together. I will say it's here. Let's find out. Okay. Good luck, Freaks, with your exams tomorrow. Yes, we're all heading back to the carrier. And we're going to do the magic trick, too. But make sure you do not look backwards while we do the magic trick, guys. If you look backwards, you will be left behind in the system in the ship you're in. So if you do want to risk it, make sure you're in a ship that does above 25 light year jumps. Speaking of which, am I in one of those ships? I am not. So... In case I get left behind, I am going to go and um, get into my dolphin. Freaks, I know you guys already did the magic trick, but were you guys on stream? No, you were not on stream. And why? Because somebody destroyed my ship and I couldn't join you. Let's see here. Going to get to the place. Oh yeah, look at this. I have... I have two lasers, one hurt, one heal. Sounds like you need to know how to learn how to use your lasers. Let's see here. They look the same. Hmm. That is hard. If only there were a way to tell our things to do different things. I have a button here. Where, where is this button here? Oh, did I get rid of it? Yep, I got rid of it. If you guys don't know, you could do this. And just clear all chat. It's a gone. I use that a lot because um, whenever we're filming... Because I friend no matter whoever, whoever friends me, I accept. But what what tends to happen, though, is um, I'll friend a lot of people. And they'll be logging in and off of the game. And I'll be filming something with Sparks. And it'll say, like, um, Commander Harry Balls has entered, <laughs> has joined the game. Commander Harry Balls has left the game. Commander Harry Balls has entered the game. And I'm like, huh, that's going to mess with our continuity. I don't mind that it happens. It's just that sometimes we'll reshoot a scene. And then people are going to be wondering, what happened to Commander Harry Balls? No, it's clear. Slash clear. It happens so much that I, I used to have a um, a button on my stream deck that would just do it for me. But I guess I got rid of it. Oh, I kind of want to do the magic trick where we all get left behind. But we'll do that at the at the, um, at the very last place we go to. I will... I will kind of say this the very last place we go to isn't a forgotten or hidden place it's somewhere where everybody knows about however commander disemboweled has has uh, was able to get his fleet carrier to go to i'll say it right now uh midder and hollow um a place we all know and love but the problem is is getting your carrier to midder and hollow is nearly impossible because everyone's trying to get there and experience like the hu the very super fast orbit around um, New Africa, and he finally got um, his carrier to lock onto it, and he's got a great view. And I think um, I think that's where we will go later on in the stream and have fun there. And if Disco wants to leave that spot, I wanted to see if we can get ourselves uh, geared into space in our spacesuits. Um, cause that'd be really cool to see, um, be able to just float around in our spacesuits outside of the carrier. Um, now I've tested it where if you go, if you get, uh, if you get left behind from the carrier, I've tested it where 
sometimes if you log to the main menu and you log back in you'll be floating right because otherwise what happens you're left standing when you get uh, left out in space you're, you're in you're in your standing animation but if you log out to the main menu and you come back you're kind of in your like free floating animation and that's that's more desirable however it's been um, it's been uh, my experience where I log back in and it, and it just sends me back into my ship so I don't get it wait what are people saying you can't disembark there's too high gravity He, wait, here or where you are? Okay, here. We might be cl so close. Apparently, we're so close to the gas giant that disemboweled can't disembark from his ship because it's too high gravity. Is that true? Is it? Can that happen? Hey, hey, Sky Zeno. The best kind of Zeno. How you doing? Nice to see you. Explorer T10? Uh, yes, when it's attached to a fleet carrier, it's an Explorer T10. Let's see here. Also, we just needed it to um, use the ship launch fighters because where we were going, we couldn't get there with regular ships. Uh, neither could we get there with uh, ship launch fighters, apparently. Okay, I actually want to fly around in... Okay, we should take an, um, a fighting vessel, guys. I'm going to use... You know what? I'm going... For the trip, I'm going to take the the dolphin. And if I don't get left behind by the carrier... I'll... I'll... I'll, <laughs> I'll, um, I'll keep the dolphin, just in case I get left behind in the carrier. Uh, but if I do make it over there, then there we go. Oh, Terrell Evans, thank you so much. Thanks so much for the donation. They say, I really don't get Odyssey. 99% of the content in the game is Horizons. Lol. Hey, I can't disembark either. That's so weird. Yeah, I guess, I guess we can't. Hold on. Let me try a different ship. Maybe there's different parts of my carrier that I can disembark in. Let's see. Let me try this. Okay, let me let me respond to Terrell Evans. Yeah, a lot of the game. Yeah, you're totally fine with just staying in Horizons. I mean, the game is basically the same. Personally, I like foot stuff. Foot stuff. <laughs> I like um, walking around. Um, because I like the things that it offers. But I totally get what you're saying in that like. I mean, what are you buying, right? If you're totally content with what you have in the game so far, I mean, there really is nothing else. I can't disembark. Guys, how did you disembark? I can't disembark. Maybe if I, see, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to switch to hangar bay and see if, okay, what hangar bay am I in? I'm in landing pad three. Okay, let me get into a different uh, ship and let's see if it changes me to different hangar bay. Let me try a medium ship. This is a medium ship, right? Okay, here we go. Let's try this. I've never noticed this before. Okay, this is a brand new thing, guys. Apparently, if you're too close to a gas giant, the, f the gravity affects you. And I think this might be... Uh, yep. Okay, I'm at... Um, Hangar Bay... Usually it says... I'm now in hangar bay. What hangar bay is this? I can't read. Oh, you know what? If I go to the surface, it'll tell me. Yeah, isn't this weird? We can't disembark. That's so weird. I'm going to explore new planet for my screenshots editions. Skyzino, you, know, you got to share your stuff on Twitter because it's really, really, really good. Oh, this is kind of a cool view, though. 
Hangar Bay 6. No, 9. Oh, this is pretty, though. It's not, I think I need to be Hangar Bay 7 over there. Okay, let me try that. Let me try that again. Okay. Shipyard. Let's go on Hangar Bay 7. Before this thing takes off. Okay, Anaconda. Use that. Go to the launch pad. Okay, Mike Hawk, did you were you able to get in? Zipping around. It's funny. I'm in a ship inside my carrier. I can't get out of my carrier. Okay, I'm in hangar bay. I don't know. Let's see which hangar bay this one is. Could be a bug. Have you tried to relog the game? Let me see. Yeah, let me try to relog. Because I'm sort of where I wanted to be. This is bay 6. It could just be an issue of relogging. Yeah, let me just relog back into the thing. Luckily, we're we're we are where we want to be. It won't be long before the carrier jumps anyway. Joshua De La Frente can disembark now. And I still cannot. Did anybody try any ships that worked for them more than others? Let me try a courier. Do I have a courier? I do have a courier. Mars, re-jump to super cruise. I don't have time. <laughs> There's like a minute before the, the carrier is about to jump out. Okay. Just reach up to. No, you guys are trying to leave me behind again. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll do that. I see. I'll do this. Mulan Reichs has a good idea. Okay, hopefully, it's enough time to accomplish what I set, I intend to do. There we go. I did it. It worked. I went to the surface and then de disembarked. But at the same time, the carrier services have been discontinued. I'm at this weird zone now. Oh, I got teleported somewhere. Oh, it put me back inside the ship. <laughs> oh, God. So I was able to leave the ship just in time to be sent back in. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. Let's look at the carrier then. I mean the courier. Okay, again, guys, if you are headed, if you guys want to meet us, carrier management has been restricted due to upcoming jump. Okay, wonderful. Can I do this? Can I just go to Galaxy Map? Thanks. Okay, where we're going is here. We're going to this place. Camu Ruck. Amar, Kemu Rukamar. I'm pretty sure that's not how you s say it. Looks look people are already there. Who's there already? Are we there? Are we both there and here? Are we in super position? Look, we're both here and not here. Um, we're going here, guys. S uh, in the bubble, where this is also um horizons friendly. We are in um, Odyssey only because the last place we're going to go to on this trip um, has an Odyssey element to it. Uh, but y you can go to these places while we stream. We won't see you in stream, but we'll feel that you're there. We'll be like, oh, I bet there's somebody else here. I'm in your hangar. This is about how are you in the hangar? Where are you? How are you here? Wait. How did you get here? <laughs> We're about to take off. And you're T-posing in front of my ship. How has this happened?
That is so funny. Okay, so like most of our streams, we we find ways to get in places we're not supposed to. Can you you can't move around? Don't turn around. To, you can move around. Okay, yeah, just don't look backward. Okay, we're about to take off. Okay, the drives are engaging. <laughs> and this embout is is going to ride the fleet carrier from the hangar bay. Oh, I can hear the engine spooling up. Okay, he's now floating. Okay, can I... Disembowelled says, okay, you're still with us, Disembowelled, I think? I can't look outside of my ship to see if you're still here or, or if you've been turned into cream of wheat. Uh, on the wall behind us. I hope you're still here. It still says you're in the other the other place. Okay, I can hear that we're in the witch space. We're inside of the witch space, guys. Oh my god, wouldn't it be so cool if like there's a Thargoid mothership that just like hyperdicks your carrier? That would be amazing. I hope that happens one day. Okay, we're coming back in, and we're gonna go. We're gonna look outside and see if disemboweled is still outside. It, according to my databanks, he's here. I don't see him. Okay, he got teleported into the carrier, because usually when you stand up in the uh, the carrier. Um, I wanted to show you guys. I'll show you guys when we go to the next place. If you don't know that you can stand up in the carrier while it's jumping, you can. It's possible. Hey, Commander Exorcist. How you doing? It's good to see you. They have lore spoke that he will be smashed into the bulkhead. <laughs> yeah. All right, here. Okay, actually, can I locate you? Asks disemboweled. Can I locate you? I don't know. Let's see. Are you somewhere? I don't see you. How did you get in the hangar while we were in? We were jumping, by the way. Because usually, if I'm in the hangar while it jumps, it teleports me into the ship. Just took the elevator after getting up. Oh. Okay. Hold on, I'm very curious. I'm very, very curious. I want to see what it looks like from the bar. I will confess, the main reason why I got a carrier was for the bar. Yet again, I broke the game. I didn't break the game. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everyone's... How are you? Oh, look at this. That's a nice sight here. That yeah, looks cool. We're at, a, we're at the uh, cappuccino planet all right beautiful phantom of space that's a cool name phantom of space hey we're almost wearing the same outfit hey yeah no no you you buddy now you right there okay guys get into something that can do combat all right there's a there's a ship here let me get it ready over here I don't see you disemboweled. I don't know if you're in the instance. Okay, let's get a sh combat ship here. My only combat ship is also the T-10. <laughs> so I'll, I'll use the T-10. It's fine. Okay. Alright guys, let's go. Let's go. We got a war to fight. Okay, now when we get there, they're going to want to pick a fight with us, okay? But uh, resist... All temptation until we like kind of tour the place because this place is really special. It's a pirate bar. Commander Exorcist says, "Good to see you guys too. I'm hoping we get introduced to a Thargoid mega ship with carrier interdiction." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Totes my goats. Oh, this is the only ship there is in the game. I love it. Type ten. Yes. 
Okay, let's get over there. Okay, I gotta make sure my um my uh fighter guy is with me. Guys, do you wanna see how much money my fighter guy has made? Are you guys getting, gonna get ready to like totally like pull your hair out? Watch this. Look at my three hundred million? Three hundred million he says. My fighter guy has made close to two billion dollars. He is elite, elite one, and private share is only ten percent because I have had him on board since he was a little baby. But regardless, this guy has made two million dollars. Ezra Holder, I've had him since it started. Here we go. All right, where are we going? First thing we're going to do... Oh, God, let's avoid the asp. There we go. Second thing we're going to do is glamour shots. Because this is a freaking cool location. Look at this place. Oh, yeah. Who'd want to mess with <laughs> with us? Oh, this place is cool. All right. Enough of that. Let's go to where why we came here. Okay. Let's see. Blazing Dynamo. That's where we're going. Alright guys, select Blazing Dynamo and engage. Oh, I just realized I shouldn't have brought a T10. Oh well. Win in Rome. Okay, I should have brought a smaller ship. Okay, it's at the other planet. Wonderful. Okay, disembowel. Do you need a, a wing invite again? Let's see. Invite the team and Martian Turtle. Invite the team. Okay, guys. Careful. This place is spicy. It's a it's a pirate bar called the Blazing Dynamo. And yes, that's right. It's in the rings. Now, of the places we've gone to, this is the least amount of glitch we're going to have. So this is a, an actual normal place, right? But it is by far not boring. I swear to you. That's why we're bringing a combat ship. Why is everywhere we go, there are rings? Because that's where they hide stuff, rings. You don't hide stuff in the, you know, right next to where we can see everything. Yeah. Exactly. Rings are cool. Also, everything else is super far away. Because there, there are places that are um, in nebulas and stuff. But those are way too far. There's one that's sort of close, but it's two carrier jumps. And I don't feel like doing that. Okay. Coming in. Coming in. Okay, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, I'll do it. I'll do it afterwards. Okay, we're coming in here. Fire groups. Fire groups are ready. All right. Okay, I'm gonna push record. I wanna record this. This valve's already jumping in. Oh god, I hope it's on this side of the rings. Please be on this side of the rings. Please be on this side of the rings. Please be on this side of the rings. Alright. Okay, this place, I don't know if it's broken or what. But there's this over here. Unauthorized installation. And it's painted purple. And then over here is a mega ship. So it's a two for one. You got your installation... And then you got this mega ship over here, the Blazing Dynamo. And on top of all that, it's in the freaking rings. I mean, does it get much better than this? I submit it does not. Okay, I'm going to go ahead in my fighter and I'm going to pilot it. Oh, this place is on fire. 
Somebody, somebody's attacked this place already. Okay, watch out. Oh god, there's a huge gash in it. Is it normally like this? Last time I was here, it wasn't like this. Oh, I wonder if this is normally what it looks like. What is even in there? Okay, there's the bulkhead is broken. But below that... Okay, you can you can kind of see the ring. The walkway thing here. But then underneath that is like this hard candy. It's like a jawbreaker underneath all this. Look at this. Oh, that's interesting. I think it's supposed to look like this. Cause look at all the look at all these things here. I've never noticed this before. How weird. Okay, those look like I don't know if those are like space rebarb or if those are like the walkways inside of the station. Alright, that's cool. There's a data package too if you scan the uplink. Okay, data package. Composition scanner? No. Okay, I'm gonna scan the ship uplink once I get into the main ship. Let me just tour around here a bit. I'm gonna attach my camera to the front of my fighter here. Like that. Okay. Okay, now I'm just gonna tour around first. I'm gonna take a look see. Okay, there's some gunfire going on already. Oh, there's some cool holes over there. Oh, that's the other thing I wanted to see in the last place, to see if they had any like um, service holes or whatever that we can fly our fighters into. Oh, there's a firefight going on over there. What's going on over there? So this place is inhabited by pirates, believe it or not. So if you want to do some bounty hunting, this is a great place to do it. Because they'll keep respawning in here. Following this, this uh, viper over here. Let's see if I can get him to blow up on camera. Oh, I just got him. Okay, there's another fight over here. Let's see. <laughs> Let's see if they get this guy on camera. The pirates here are like, we don't serve your kind. There she goes! Ah, oh, kablooey! Wonderful. Oh, this place is great. I look. This place has the best best atmosphere in terms of like just like, you know, you're out here in a pirate outpost. There's something on fire to the left. Maybe the pirates damaged that uh, mega ship and they brought it here, and now it's like they're like. Um, uh, commandeered ship. I don't know the uh, the lore of this facility, but that's what that's where I'm going to go with it. After I make this cool pan, I'm gonna go fly in here. All right, cool. Let's go inside. Okay. Alright, let's see. Can we fly in here? 
I think we can. Whoa! -ho -ho. Oh, that's right. That's okay. Nyrom. This is cool. So, guys, at a certain point, I'm going to make the uh, station very mad at us. Okay, whoever's in the python, I'm going to follow you inside of there. Go back in there. I want to I wanna tell you. Also, do you know there's a missile following you? <laughs> do you realize you're under attack? Okay, here we go. Okay, line it up, line it up. Get in there. Woohoo! Nice job, guys. Yeah, I don't think we're allowed in there. I think that's why they're firing at us. Having said that, um, watch, guys, come here. Go back inside. There's a secret door over here. All you need to do is run into it and it opens. Okay. This door. Right. Oh, God. Right here. Just run in. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Don't do it yet. Because I'm being pushed around here. Okay. Run into the door below you. Actually, it's the door below you. Run into this door. I'll do it. Okay. Maybe it's not that door. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Is it this one? Come on. Open. Nope. Nope. There we go. It opened. We got inside. It's the power core. Oh boy, it's crowded in here. It's crowded. Hold on. Backing out, coming back in. There we go. Watch out. It's a bit spicy in here. We got civilians here. So again, if you are if you just play Horizons, this exists for you. This isn't just like a Odyssey thing. Okay, now the station hates us. <laughs> I hope you guys have enough shields. There we go. There's the stations. I don't know why, but they decided to put guns here. Actually, it makes sense now that I realize what's happening. Um. Yeah, I don't think we can, uh, can we, uh, can we put this in our, uh, is this a, uh, a, a, a power, <laughs> a power thing we can put into our, our materials and keep, take home? Yeah, come over here, it's safer in here. Where are we? I don't know. And what I mean is, I don't know how to pronounce where I am. I'll tell you in just a second here. Hold on. Let me look at chat. While this is happening, you guys look at this. I need to see what chat's been talking about. Let's see here. Meta Alloys. Looks like a giant claw. Is the station on fire? Support struts for the ring. Can you dock in this? No. However, the next place we go to, we can dock. And then to answer the question, where are we? We are... Here we go. I have a bounty here, so I know where I am. So we are in the station of Kemu Rukumar. Kemu Rukumar. And once you go to Kemu Rukumar, you find a place that's called... Um, Blazing Dynamo. 
and that's where we are. And this place is in the rings. Oh, not, it's, it's actually right above the rings. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go out. Oh yeah, that's cool. Um, speaking of, how is my um, Type 10 doing? Just like hanging out by itself. I think it's doing fine. Hey, Made of Vendetta's here. I haven't seen you in a while. How are you doing, Made of Vendetta? Uh oh. I'm getting shot at by something. Something's angry. Let's see here. Who's attacking us? Let's go beat him up. This guy. Attack. Doom kaboom, let's do it. Let's show these pirates who's who's blazing dynamo this belongs to. Let's take over this this place. Whoa, watch out! That's why you always pack two fighters. Deploy. Ezra, get out there. Okay. Attack this guy's here. I'm gonna position myself strategically. Get this guy here. Okay, let's take over this place. The blazing dynamo will be ours. If we can get a team to take out the the uh, the dynamo's um, guns, and the rest of us out here, we'll we'll deal with the fighters. And if you're asking, the answer is yes. Uh, this t this is a turreted. Type 10, because I cannot be bothered to turn the ship myself. Did we? Can we destroy the reactor? Unfortunately, we can't. It would have been fun, though. It would have been fun if we destroyed the reactor and a bunch of like uh, power regulators came out. See you later, Marion. All right, let's get this guy. Uh oh. It sounds like a you problem. Uh oh, disemboweled's almost dead. There we go. Taking out this guy. Do I have... I don't have the chaff. Crazy. Oh, freaks. Right about now would be a great time. There we go. <laughs> there it is. Disemboweled's dead. How are you dead, disemboweled? This guy's name is Hate. He sounds bad. Oh boy, it's funny because the last place we were, the f when we, it had like a, it was a cafe, right? It had beer, tea, and uh, what was the other thing it had? Beer, tea, and coffee. This place. Okay, this guy. Wh whose SLF is that belong to? That guy. All right, Ezra, get back out there. Oh wait, no, not him, not him, not him, not him, not him. Uh oh. Uh, defend, hold. I accidentally, sorry. There we go. Attacking the NPC, not the player. There we go. Okay, while well, the battle is raging, let's get closer to the to the uh, blazing dynamo. Let's go ahead and scan this thing. It's a Bowman class science vessel. 
Not today. Okay. Look, chemical processors. Anybody need chemical processors? This thing is leaking out stuff. <gasps> There's a cargo bay here. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna get closer here. Ship up log. See data link scanner. There we go. Data downloaded. Blazing Dynamo data package complete. The Blazing Dynamo has been boarded by pirates and in the uh, Kumuku Malikilimaka system. I've evaded their base defenses and connected to the data port spe specified. A package designated simply as Eli has downloaded itself into my auxiliary storage. It's almost leapt on it. It almost leapt on a board. I'm returning back to base. I guess something happened here. Attack. Who's attacking me? Who is this? You? Certainly not you. Alright, let's get this guy. There we go. Hey, we're wanted. Why are we wanted? There's a bunch of pirates. Alright, let's see here. Who's this? This is a, this is a screenshot here. Hold on, I need to adjust this. Okay, let's move the ship up to the left. Angle it just so. There we go. Yeah, that's some screenshot right there. Yeah, I'm defending the ship. Oh, that looks cool. Check my storage, says DJ Camp. Change your weapons, Mars. <laughs> What's going on? That's a lot of pulse lasers, eh? Who's attacking me? Who's that? Alright, friend. Alright, friendo, take the full might of a fully operational Type 10. Ah, uh, you wanna... You wanna mess? Ah, uh, right there. Get the... Get this stepping. See you later, Viper. No, that's a that's a destroyed vulture. Oh no, was I not recording? All right, let's see here. Oh, let me check my views. Did I not record that last bit? View. Large thumbnails. I want to make sure I got that aspect. That was really cool. Oh no, I'm under attack. Sort by date. Two gigs. I think I did. Let's see. Oh, I didn't record that. Okay, let me try that again then. That's too bad. 
Let's see here. Well, let me send out my fighter though. Fighter deployed. Uh oh, fighter lock launched. No, I want you to depart, dumb fighter guy. Deploy. There we go. Alright, there we go, we did that. Alright, cool. Now I can go back to here. There we go. See, I believe he is missing some more lasers, <laughs> says Radio Calvo. Yeah, I got a lot of lasers on this thing. Let's see. Joshua can't instance anymore. I'm surprised they're still firing at us here. Is everybody still here or do you guys leave? Uh, in the instance. Yeah, with this thing, you're fully covered in lasers. Out there. Is my fighter still around? Let's go. Let's get rid of this guy. Oh, it's system authority. Uh oh. Okay, our um, notoriety isn't up, so it's fine. Why is this embowed like 30 miles away? I think we won the war. Check my inventory. No, nothing. There's nothing in my inventory. Alright, guys. Let's see here. Close that. Okay. Let's go to the next stop. Wait, what time is it? Yeah. Let's go to the next place. Now, the next place. Um, we can land that, actually. It is a landable place. That's as much as I'm going to tell you right now. Okay. There we go. Now, this place kind of is famous. It was famous when it was discovered, but I think everyone's forgotten about it by now. And the reason why I think people forgot about places like this is because Odyssey came around, and then we all went to places with atmospheres and all those kinds of things. And where we're going is here. HIP 100 Five three nine. We're going there, guys. And I should probably tell my carrier to go there too. Okay. Carrier management. Next destination. So we got some time before we 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 go there. And then where there we are going. This time we'll go to the actual place. Here. Oh wait, don't go here. That's the wrong. Select one of these guys. Um, I'm gonna choose. I'm gonna choose this one. Security there. Because if you select that ringed planet, quote unquote planet, it actually um, puts you like 400 light seconds away. So select one of the moons. Is what you need to do. I say that, but it's, I'm the one taking us there. Alright, let's take a look before <laughs> we have to go to the next spot. I'm being pushed. Guys, oh yeah, my ship, I can't move. Come push, push my ship. Watch this, you wanna see, you guys wanna see a Type 10 go as fast as, as it can? Check this out. 500, 500, 600, 800, 674. 
There we go. The fastest Type 10 in the world. Sayonara, muchachos. I got a date with destiny. Look at that. Oh, yeah, the power of force cannons. Okay, let's go ahead and... I am... People are really mad at me in this system. Okay. Lock destination. And my telephone is telling me to make sure I charge my phone or otherwise you, I will not see my chat. Alright, this next place is my favorite place. Of all these places I've gone to and shown you, this next place is my favorite. Where are we going? We're going to HIP 103... Where is it? 10539. HIP 100539. But take go in the go in the carrier. Almost there. Not there at all. Alright guys, so far what has been your guys' favorite place of the three places we went to? The first place was the Osmium, the hidden Osmium facility that had no osmium in it but it was inside of the ring so much so that the asteroids themselves were inside of the facility um, did you like the uh, uh, the runaway station that the only way to get there is to have it run into you in the gap of the rings or is it so far this place which is a pirate cove that you can fly into and there's a cool um, shipwrecked mega ship there. We are wanted. Yeah, we are wanted right now, but I don't think we'll be, uh, I don't know what happens. What happens when you're wanted and you go to your own carrier to do, does my carrier mind that I'm a, I'm a bad man? People like this one because of all the uh, pew pew fun. That was lots of fun. I did like that. Uh, Disemboweled liked the first one. That was kind of fun. I want to see cops can shoot you, but the carrier won't care. If the carrier doesn't care, but will the carrier then shoot at the cops? I wonder if there's a way we can do that. Okay. Press docking. Okay, so this next place is a mixture of all three places we've gone to. Okay. NFA Peng likes oatmeal. Someone before said they liked socks. Now people like oatmeal. I'm glad you guys feel comfortable that this is a safe place to share your likes and dislikes like a glove. Look at that. Biome. Martian Turtle likes the first one too. Okay. Mission Cartographics. Nope. Next thing I do is I check this. Yep. And then I'm going to go into my... In case I get left behind, I'm going to go into my dolphin. Now, guys, don't worry. If you have a carrier, normally you don't get left behind. But on our Ghost Draft space bar, we have a certain way of... Uh, we have a certain tradition we do when we go into hyperspace on this carrier. And oftentimes, people get left behind. <laughs> they get flung out of the window and they get left behind. If you haven't seen this before, this is... Enjoy it while it lasts. I'll say that. All right? Enjoy this next super cool magic feature of the carrier before they, they patch it out. Because it's my favorite thing to do. And I really hope they don't get rid of it. But I think they will. Rust, Rust likes breathing. It's been a pastime for me as well. Rust is here. Disemboweled is here. Fantastic. 
I'm going to go to the bar and look out the window. Very nice. The next thing I do is I stand on the furniture. La di da. There we go. And then I stand here and assert my dom dominance. Look at me dominating these green suits. All right. Hey, this is about to come up here. Come on, guys. Stand on the furniture. It's fine. Y even if your shoes are on. It's my carrier. I'll allow it. <laughs> hey, Bud's just going to sit down. Martian Turtle sitting down. All right, let's look at this. Oh, look at this. Yeah, this is what it's all about. We have become one. We're 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 now the elite dangerous Voltron. <laughs> Yo, you moated at the same time. Yeah. It's hilarious. Wonderful. There we go. That's how you know you've made it. Oh, look at this view. Like when I got the carrier, all I wanted was the view. And now that I'm here, oh look at this. Okay, every, everybody alternate. Some people point, some people clap. There we go. We're like some kind of like Hindu god. Fantastic. Somehow you, you just magically put your glasses on. Oh look, if I get a certain distance, your glasses don't render anymore. That's a junk piece people passed out. Whoever's in the hat the yeah, you go yeah, you go over there. Then you go on top. There you go. Everybody wants to join in. Look at this. It's a party. My body is a party and everyone's inside. There you go. <laughs> Look at this. Oh boy. This is great. How many people can we get in here? Oh, speaking of which. Okay, we're wasting our time here. We gotta go to the table of truth. I'm a fool. Everybody, come on. Okay, this about Martian Turtle. Everybody. We gotta get to the table of truth. Okay, you guys come up and then um, everybody come out of the uh, the wing and get everybody up here. Okay, come on. Oh boy, look at this view. Okay, once you're up here, get out of party and disembowels here. Okay, you guys are here. Come to the table of truth. Must stand on table. Aha, we did it. Okay, we need to invite everybody else too. There we go. Oh, I fell off. No, no, I'm on. Oh, I fell off again. There we go. If you guys didn't know, why did I leave wing? So I can invite you guys. Okay. Let me get you guys in here. Uh, invite the team. Uh, Martian Turtle. Accept team invite. Oh, no, 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 no. You guys are already here. Oh, Martian Turtle's coming. Okay, Martian Turtle's coming here. We can't sit here to get to the bottom anymore fast. Okay, well, what I was trying to do is get you guys up here. But, um, don't get left behind, alright? Okay, go ahead and sit. Lift doesn't work for you. It says it's in use. Okay, everybody sit down. And then the magic trick will be at uh, 2 minutes and 47 seconds. Stand up, all right. But whatever you do, once the carrier starts moving, do not look backward, all right. It's like that story. If you turn backward, it'll be turned into salt. Okay, but in this case, instead of being turned into salt, it'd be ejected from. Um, uh, Freaks, you can do it for the funny and get left behind. <laughs> the stream will will exist. Um, without you. Okay, three minutes. Okay, everybody sit down. And at two minutes and 47 seconds, stand up. 
Oh yeah, it does that. Sometimes it forces you to stand up. I don't get it. Are you still being forced to stand up? Disemboweled? Alright. Okay, we're almost we're almost to the time. Everyone is inside, literally. <laughs> Almost time. Almost go time. Well, f this about you might just want to um, time your sitting down with the uh, the magic trick. So that way, it'll work for you. Okay, we're almost there. Three minutes and we're at two minutes forty seven seconds. Stand up. Goes the horn. Can we go into space legs? In space, yes. There we go, standing up. There we go, I've, stand, I've stood up. Okay, Frakes is able to do it. And, ah, oh, yes. Martian Turtle, you're standing. Disabelled, you're standing. All right, cool. Cool, Phantom of Space, he's standing. Look at this. Fantastic. Uh oh. I can't go back up the stairs, guys. Okay, if you run, you can go up the stairs. Ah, oh, look at this. Okay, whatever you guys do. So, we're gonna, instead of <laughs> enjoying the jump from the seats, we're gonna enjoy the jump from the ready room. Which I feel like should be a thing, you know? I'm afraid to sit down. If you sit down, do you think we can get back up? Freaks, sit down. I want to see if we can get back up. I'm flying? Look at me, I'm flying. Let me see if it shows my animation is flying. No, my animation is still standing. Instructions unclear. Stuck in seat. <laughs> well, next time. Next time, uh, when I say uh, stand up at 2 minutes and 47 seconds, um... I'll somehow try to make that more clear. What happens if you are space stakes in space? Yes, it's possible. There's many ways you c it, it can happen, but you, uh, what tends to happen is that your battery, your suit battery, runs out and you die. That's what happens. Okay, about a minute left. Here we go. If you guys ever wanted to see what it was like to go into a uh, hyperspace in the ready room this is it your your prayers have been answered in fact I'm gonna stand on a table I'm gonna surfboard it there we go how much time left 37 seconds phantom of space is exploring oh phantom of space come back inside here because you will be left behind out there uh Make sure you're in the uh, this forward zone, because if you go to the bar, which is what I usually do during this during these times, um, you get left behind, and you're floating in space. If anybody gets left behind, oh, it's happening! It's happening! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, he's outside! <laughs> this is outside. Okay. We may or may not have left lost disemboweled. <laughs> he went through the window. Um, okay. If you are left behind in space, uh, let me know in chat and in, uh in stream chat. Okay, we're going. Okay, I'm nailed to the floor, I can't move. That was amazing. Did you disemboweled, did you see it on your your end that you could clip outside of the carrier? Alright, let's see how many people we lost <laughs> from our carrier jump. It's one of my favorite things about this this thing. Okay, you get teleported over here. Okay, did we lose anybody? Phantom of Space is here. Did we all make it? Phantom of Space, I'm glad you made it. Martian Turtle got left behind. 
Disemboweled is clapping, but I don't see him. We lost Martian, Martian Turtle. Did we lose Disemboweled also? Let's see if he's outside. <laughs> Meta Vendetta is here. Oh, wait. Are you seeing Meta Vendetta as sitting? Because you will see people, if you get lost in space, no in chat. Okay, com Drunken Commander's here. Frakes, Haybud's here. Maiden Vendetta's literally right in front of me. Martian Turtle has killed everybody who's, who, who is see seated. Alright, guys. This next spot. This next spot, you need a medium or small ship. You can't land here in a large ship. All right, so go come to the the spaceways building here. How do you kill yourself? You don't need to, Martian Turtle. So if you a Python will work. If you did get left behind, um, if you are now in space, uh, what you do is you're gonna have to Control Alt Delete, <laughs> leave the game, go back into Odyssey, uh, go back into Horizons. And that should teleport you here. So log back into Horizons and it'll teleport you here. And then log back into Odyssey. Or if you just want to like die, you can just turn your shields on and then um, uh, turn your shields on and then run your battery out. Okay, I'm going to get in medium ship here. Which medium ship? I'll, just, I'll keep the one I have. Yeah, I'll keep the golden drug. It's a small ship, I know, but... Oh wait, I wanted to see out the window. I wanted to see if you could see planets. Oh god, you can. Whoever's in the Corvette... It's fine here if you're in the Corvette, but you, where we're going, it doesn't have large landing pads. That's a nice view. Ah, that's nice. That's nice. Okay. Restock is broken. Oh, that sucks. What? I wonder why that is. Is everyone? Is absolutely everybody having the restock um, broken thing? Or is it just some people in some instances and some people in others? Okay, launching. So, out of all the places we've been to, this next place we're going now is my personal favorite. Because it has a mix of everything we've seen in the stream in it. Alright, let me um, see here. Let me make sure people are here. Let's see. Made of Vendetta. Where is... Oh, I see. I think people are still trying to log back on. It's one of the... Uh, the, the negatives of being left in space <laughs> is that you actually have to leave the game and come back. Okay, Disemboweled has made it to the main menu. All right, where we're going is there. Now, if you come to the system again, and you're bringing your carrier, don't target this. It doesn't put you around it here. Like if you target like a regular gas planet, what it does it it sends you way out here. So that's why we've landed at these places. We're going to row platform. Now, row platform isn't a hidden place, um, but it might be a forgotten place. Like I said before, it was very well known before but I haven't seen anybody go back here in in literally years 
and it's the most unique station. And I say station. This isn't a mega ship. This isn't an installation. It's an actual station. And on top of that, it's not an asteroid station, but it's in the rings. And we're, and we're going there. We're going there. We went there. Okay, this involved is local. Invite the team. Martian Turtle is here. Invite the team. Fantastic. Service scan complete. Oh, that's right. We should probably scan these rings because since it's a station, I wonder if we can just mine this place. Oh wait, I have serv I have scanners. Hold on. Fire groups. Service scanner. I have a service scanner. Too far away. Mars, my re my restock is broken. Oh, I think um I think they went on strike. I think some of my my restock person is French. All right. Too far. How close do I have to be to this thing? Have you guys noticed some some uh planetary rings are so large? Um. There we go. That you can't hit the rings because they're too far. We you're too far from the planet. We should try mining and glitched rings. I know of such a place, but I feel like Zimpal probably knows a better place. All right. So what kind of? Let's see. What do they have here? They have peanut here. All right. However, where we're going, it would be so cool if there was a hot spot here but there's not okay this is it this is my favorite spot on this tour come in there's nothing there's nothing glitchy about this place either it's just a regular regular place but in a very irregular place come in fast uh oh I missed I missed. It's fine, everybody. Row platform. All these places we got to. In the bubble. Not that hard to get to. There we go. Whoa! Everything went crazy. I am now doing flips for some reason. There it is. It is a outpost in the rings. This place is nuts. Look at how dusty it is. Here we go. It's an old outpost. How, why is it an old outpost? What makes it an old? There are new types. Okay, w but what about this is is like um. There we go. This view here is my favorite. You get the uh, like the big old gas thing in there. And you attach the uh, camera to my the nose here. Wait. Okay, so you do this, you point at something, right? You go out, you go like this. And you line it up like a so. Then you look at the thing you're pointing at and lock it. There we go. There we go. Look at this spot. Look at this spot, guys. We made it. How cool is this place, huh? Mm. 
Also, good luck to anybody trying to dock because I realize there's only so many landing pads. Oh, this place is so cool. It's a cool looking outpost too. Like there was say, somebody was saying, um, a Martian turtle was saying that it's an old design outpost. But I like all these little structure things they have to it. So I wonder if we can mine the stuff around here. I wonder what kind of materials are here. And if there are any materials, if any of the materials we mine here are sellable immediately to the station. Like you just mine outside of the station and then you just go back to it and you sell to it. I wonder if that's possible. I'm going to do that. I'm going to look up. I'm going to see what it what its uh, imports are. Take a tour around here. Alright, let's see if we can make it in between here. Aha, I did it. Go back around. Think I could think I make it? Think I make it? I did it. Alright, Titan's Daughter. Yeah, Titan's Daughter is right above the rings. Except for everybody knows about Titan's Daughter. This place... Are you kidding me? I wasn't recording that entire time? Okay. Titan's Daughter, uh, if you guys don't know, is w one of the most beautiful places in the bubble. Um, but it's, it's not a forgotten place. I think people have forgotten about this place. <laughs> I think maybe because it's a it's an outpost. Let's see here. Let's do some tricks. Ooh, that was close. That was close. Alright, let's go like this. I'll try to go into that. Into right between it. Let's see here. This way, this way is nice because it's got this, the star. I don't know what kind of planet though that is. It's like a star gas giant. Thanks. Yeah, rogue platform. Thanks, Ro Rome Grown, for uh, 
fielding that question. Okay. Now hopefully we can get everybody to land here. Uh, because um, it's really pretty. Once you're in the concourse, you can see the rocks from the concourse here. So that's the element, the Odyssey element of this place. And I'm being shot at. This is about saying, come check this out. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. What is it? You found something. Oh, what is this? Can you go inside? Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Hey, I can't go in. Oh, how do you get in there? You... Oh, you can go in here. Can you fly inside of it now? No, that's that's about it. Only from above the dome and just a little bit. Let's see. Hold on. Let me angle this a little bit better. This looks funnier. I'm like in it, but not in it. There's so many fighters in there, though. Oh, so many fighters totally in there now. There they go. There you go. It's a good thing we're not getting any proximity warnings. Careful, Freaks, you're going to hit the station. Let's see here. Go out here. The external view. Uh oh. <laughs> Somebody got hit with force cannons. This is a beauty. Buble Buble 2004. Welcome to the chat. If you guys are just joining us now, um, do watch when this thing is is uh, on in video because uh, you'll see lots of cool places. This is our fourth cool place. We'll go to the fifth cool place in just a second. Now the the next cool place we go to, everybody knows it's Mitter and Hollow. However, we finally got a carrier. Um, around the place so that's hard to achieve and this about it was able to do it and I I finally want to see what it's like to be on a carrier at Mitter and Hollow but before we do that I do want to get um, I want to try docking here okay guys let's see okay where is the landing pad Oh my god, that's the only thing I don't like about these stations, that I can never find the landing pad. Okay, it's over here. Landing pad 2. There we go. And... Another really cool thing about this station is that it's like a... <laughs> What's going on outside? It's a fighter over here. Fighter doesn't know he cannot land. I think that's drunken. Not that this person is drunk. Is that that's his name? His name is Drunken Commander. 
one of our uh, featured extras. Wonderful. <laughs> that was great. That was a good explosion there. I got the medium while in a... Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and disembark. Mike Hawk says, there's an outpost called Bir Biruni Horizons that looks like Earth. Like, does it look like Earth as in it's um, an Earth-like, or does it look like Earth as it, like the um, continents also? Now, guys, if you ever want to hear my voice in as as we're playing, join our Discord, and then you can hear voice as I'm I'm speaking. There's no like um, delay. Okay, another cool thing about this station is that it is a it's kind of like a high-tech station. So even though it's in the middle of the freaking asteroid belt, look how pretty it is in here. This is the prettiest station I've ever seen. Look at this place. There's the ballads here, Martian turtles here, all my friends. Look at this. And then there's the asteroids. The best view. This is it, it. I challenge you to show me a better view out of an outpost, specifically an <laughs> an outpost. This is drunken. Hey, drunken, can you get into another fighter and like greet us at the window? Also, oh, he's not here. There's a guy here. There he is. I've never seen this guy before. No, it's not him. Never mind. There's a guy here. I've never seen his character model before. In any so maybe it's just an outpost thing. But having said that, I really like his jacket. That's a cool jacket. Why not me? But there's a dude who had the craziest uh sideburns. Oh he has sideburns too. Maybe it is this guy, but he's just differently textured. I don't know. Alright, let's go back to the window. There goes Python. Okay, are there only three landing pads here? Oh my god. <laughs> I'll do that. Am I doing what you did? Martian Turtle, how are you how are you dancing in the air? Fractal Bellum. Thanks all for the adventures. Yeah, you're welcome. There's more to come. Every stream we'll have an adventure. Well that's that's not always gonna be true, but with these guys, these guys make it an adventure. I'm just turning my torch on and off. Are you really? Am I doing it too? Am I glitching too? Uh, not on my screen. Hey, can can this crate fling us out? Hey, crate. Stick? Yeah, 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 no, no, no. Yeah, you, you're doing it right. Hold on. Uh, get your wing. Get the side of your wing over there. Your your antenna on that side, and put it. You can put it through here. Okay, that's there. Okay, yeah. Angle it down more. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, angle it down more. And then we'll get we'll all get on top of it and see if you can like have us go through the uh the ceiling. Angle it down more. Again, if you want to join us on Discord, join our Discord. There's a link in the in the description and then you can hear me au même temps. You can like as I'm talking. Okay, angle it more down. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, now we're on. Okay, lift us up. Lift us up. Go for. There we go. There we go. We're going. Okay, all the way up. Through the roof. Through the roof. Keep going. We're almost there. Keep going. Ah. Oh. Disemboweled, of course, made it out. He's out of there. <laughs> He's outside. 
This evolved made it. He did it. How did you do? <laughs> this evolved. Can you can you only walk on there? Are you now stuck on him? Okay, stay here. Whoever's in the crate, just stay here. Okay, we're gonna try Martian Turtle. Oh, he's out. Okay, I see how to do it. I see how to do it. Okay, I'm coming in. Okay. Okay, so I need to go here, and then I need to get stuck right there. Okay, lift me up. Lift me up. I did it. I'm outside. Space party. <laughs> we did it, guys. We did it. We did it. All right, everybody stay here. Stay here. Oh, space party, guys. Look at this. Who invited the python? The space party. Can I do anything here? No, I can't I can't access anything. Can I do this? I can do that. Can I can I ask for um No, I was going to see if I could call Apex, but I cannot. But that, look at that. We're in space. If you guys wanted to see what it was like to be in a spacesuit out in space, this is us. Okay, don't move. I want to do a external video. Hold on. Nobody move. I, uh, I can't see anything. There we go. Where did everybody go? Okay, this symbol's right there. Oh, I went to Martian Turtle. There we go. Oh, it's beautiful. Okay, let's get further back here. Cause, so that way I can see. You can see more of the, the background. Okay, Martian turtle stuck over there. Okay, well let's be careful where we stand then. I'm gonna stand here. Okay. All right, there we go. All right, cool. Yeah, spotlight. That's beautiful. Look at the stream. Look at the stream. No, no, no. Not, don't get too close. That looks good. Well, let me get more view of this here. Can I re remove my helmet? I don't know. Actually, I don't even know how to do that regular. Can you remove your helmet, Disco? Is that a thing you can do? Or does it automatically come on? This is cool. Okay, so we figured out how to get outside of a uh, station. And now we figured out, not just on top of that, we figured out how to get out in the rings. Oh, that's even better. This is like the best day of my life. Look at this. Okay. Does anybody want to jump and see what happens? Somebody jump off. Let's see what happens. The worst that can happen will just teleport you back into the um, into the station. And then we just fling you back out here again. Okay, there goes... Oh, they're going to try to get onto the other ship. There he goes! <laughs> Look at him! Look at him go! Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming, guys. Hold on, hold on. Oh, ouch! Hold on. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm coming. Wait, wait, come back, come back. No! Okay, get a little bit closer. Get a bit closer. No, not on top of me. There we go, there we go. Okay, I'm coming. I'm here! I did it! Whoa! Woohoo! Okay. Okay, now we're here. Oh my god. This is how you know you're watching a ghost draft stream. This is this is awesome. I'm gonna freaking surfboard this guy here. Do not step. Guys, don't step here. <laughs> it's a, I advise us not to go there. Okay, hold on, hold on. Wait, no! No, don't move! I'm I'm in space! <laughs> I'm in space! I'm falling! Oh, okay. I'm going to fall back onto the crate. Ouch. Okay, I fell back onto the crate. Okay, I'm back. All right, can I go on you? Is that a thing? Let's see here. Okay, go back, go back. I almost, I almost got it, I almost got it. 
almost keep going um get lower get lower angle down angle angle lower i think whoa hmm no i can't okay i think they're going to try to get martian and and disemboweled back here Okay, I'm, I'm going to keep... Oh, okay, okay. You're going to the edge, I'm coming to you. I'm coming to you. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh, I did it. I'm here. I'm on top. I'm riding a fighter. Hold on, don't move. There we go. Okay, slowly back up. Slowly, slowly. Hold on. Let me walk backward too. Hold on. Okay, slowly back up some more. Okay, that's that's good. Keep going a little bit more. Python, back up a little bit because I want this. I want this screenshot here. Okay, back up a little bit more. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Wait, 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 wait! No, I'm falling to my death. Ah. Whatever death is at this point, right? Where am I? I'm here. It was all a dream. <laughs> Alright. Oh my god, that was so much fun. Who is this? Who are you? Did you know you can go in space? Alright, let's, let's try again. Oh my god. Imagine going into warp space in legs. Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm here sort of. A angle it a little bit more down. Angle down a little bit more. Oh, here I go. Here I go. Here I go. Whoa! Oh, I'm stuck in the roof. Alright. I'm almost there. Hold on. I'm stuck on the station. I'm in the roof. Hold on, I'm st <laughs> I'm stuck here. Keep lifting up, lifting up. No, 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 go back. Lift up. Okay. There we go. I'm here. Oh, cool. We're back. We're back. Guys, you can ride the uh the fighter. If he gets if he goes to the edge, you can ride on him. Uh However, I recommend, can we go to a rock? Yeah, this, we all need to be very gentle. Okay, slowly back up and we walk in this direction. So slowly back up and we walk in the direction we're going. All right. So let's back up. Let's see if we can get ourselves on one of these rocks. Okay, so far we're moving very good. This is great. Nice and steady. Nice and steady is doing it. Okay. You guys are all looks like you're running on my screen. I think we're all kind of like looks like we're running. Okay, yeah, this is good. Just keep this steady rate here and I think we'll be doing fine. I however I think there is a little bit of a station there if you kinda of like um go lateral to your your left a little bit. Cause I think there's a station behind you. I wonder if there's a certain distance where we get away from the uh, the station where it, it just no longer registers us anymore as part of the station and then it teleports us back. <laughs> Look at this. Python, if you can keep a light on us, don't get too close to us. Oh, wait, wait, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, slow down, guys. Everybody slow down. We are now on the Python. We're now on the Python, okay? Okay. Now, all right. So Python can go forward, but go forward slow, slow. Like, do like one, one meter per second or two meters per second. 
You're going way too fast. Hold on, let me just get to here. Yes, keep the steady rate. We want to get to those rocks. Okay, no, no, stop, stop going fast. Stop going fast. Don't go fast. Where are the rocks? They're over there. Okay, you're going a bit too fast again. Beautiful. Keep this good right here. This is good. Don't go any faster than this. If somebody can go next to a rock and light it up with your um, with your lights, so we can know where where what our destination is. Look at this, guys. Did you ever think you'd see the day where you'd see commanders running on the back of a python in space going towards asteroids from the station they just left? <laughs> oh, we need like a running comp, uh, like a, a track, like the Forrest Gump. My life is a highway. Oh, what's going on? It's a bit of a... Okay, do you need... Um, Python, do you need to change your... Um, if you want to pause and then angle your ship at the rock we want it to go to, you could do that. But remember, to move very slightly because as you're angling up, pitching up, or whatever you might be doing, you might fling us off of the back of you. Okay, I'm thinking of one that's not moving. There's a smallish one above above this one here that's sort of not moving. That's possible. Alright, here we go. I have the tire. Yeah, we totally need that. For some reason, this looks like space engineers. Okay. Yeah, don't pitch up anymore. We still have gravity. Okay, we're far from the station, but we're going forward still. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, yeah, I think we're oriented weird. Okay, hold on. Yeah, enough, actually, yeah, no more pitching, actually. Okay. Going forward. Yeah, don't change your, your, um, anything about it. Because we're kind of, like, sideways now. Hi guys. Just you know, a day in space. Okay. You. Let's go that way. Okay, how far away are we from you guys over there? Whoa, whoa, hold on, watch out, watch out. Okay, there we go. Back to normal now. Okay, we're pointed down. Actually, don't point down, we'll slide off. If you can pitch up a bit, because we're, we're going to slide off. There we go. Yeah, because our orientation is the same of that as the um, as the the base we left. Okay, we're 
we're going forward. Here, okay. Here, roll ever so slightly to the left. I mean, to, to the right. Sorry, sorry, to the right. We're almost there. Uh oh. Oh, slow down. Slow down. There we go. Yeah, if you can roll to the right just a little bit. Because we're sideways. Almost. A little bit more. Don't go forward. Don't go forward. Don't go forward. Okay, that's good. A little bit to the left now. L just a tad bit. Roll to the left. A little bit more. That's good. Perfect. Oh, no. We lost Disco. Oh, dang it. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Stop, stop, stop. Stop. Okay. Go forward just slowly. We lost one guy. Go forward. I think you're going backward. Uh oh, hold on. You're going to lose me now. Okay. Hopefully this will do it. All right, go forward. Why am I Why am I being sent forward? Wait, we're backing up. Why are we backing up? Are we meant to be backing up? What's going on? Are we rubber rubber banding? Is this we've, have we let, met some sort of limit? Oh, we are going forward. Oh, I see. Okay, hold on. Pause what you got. Pause what you're doing because we're about to fall off. We're about to fall off. Okay. All right. Marsha Turtle, you good? Okay. Good. Good. All right. Go forward. Well, hold on, slow, 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 slow. Okay, we're good here. <laughs> the big gun. He's taking out his guns. Do you have your landing gear down? I ask because I recommend putting your landing gear down in case you accidentally boost. Okay, we're almost to it. We're nearly there. Oh, careful, watch out, Martian. And hey, don't run into us, fighter. We're almost there. Actually, fighter, can you um go over there and light up that rock? That, that's how we could, it shows up on the stream a little bit better. Okay. God, that's so far away. That's <laughs> seeing how long it took to get for them to get there. We're we're nearly there though. Okay, we're we're doing a we're on a, we're on a good we're on a good pace. Don't change the pace, don't change the course. We're we're doing really well. Although whoever's above us is like putting the shadow exactly where we are. I can't see us. Oh, don't fire at us because we're, <laughs> we're we're trying to do something here. I don't know if you noticed. We're trying to get to the rocks. Almost. Almost there. I can taste it. Yeah, I definitely have the eye of the uh oh. Hold on, don't stop moving. Stop, 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 stop. Oh boy, that was crazy. What happened there? We almost fell off. Marsh Turtle fell off. Okay, it's just me now. Okay. Let's go, Soul Survivor. All right, whatever you were doing before, it was good. 
But then something happened, and then it was bad. Okay, keep going. Yeah, we'll we'll make it. We'll make it. We got plenty of time. Keep going. I really want to get to this rock. Oh, I'm falling off. Why am I falling off? Almost there. Whoa! You flew right through it. On my on my perspective, what? Flew right through the thing. Grab the laser as, as a souvenir. I think I will. Wait, is that even real? Uh oh, I'm falling backwards. I'm falling away. Oh no. Okay, I'm back. I'm good. Luckily, we're immortal, so like we're not taking actual damage. Okay. Okay, we're moving there. We're walking there. Can't take a weapon out? I can't take a weapon out. It's so very close. How many kilometers away is it? Who's. Uh, can you uh, target the Phantom? 1.27 kilometers away. Okay, not too far away then. Okay, it is It is solid. That, that uh, ship just ran into it. ETA, 11 minutes. Okay, cool. My guess is when we get there... Are we moving? My guess is that when we get there, we might have to... Don't do any, don't change any course right now. Just keep as we are. Hold on, I'm falling off. Stop. There we go. Um, don't change anything we're doing right now. But when we get there, we might have to boost up a bit. So that way I can fall on top of it. So, because my gravity is locked to how I was at, hold on, slow down. My gravity is locked to how I was at the uh, outpost. So, if I walk off the side of this python, I'll fall down. And so, I want to fall down on top of the thing here. Okay, whoever is behind us, don't bump us. Nearly there. Can the laser block your, your movement? Um, I don't know. I don't want to try it right now because I don't want to mess up for where I am. Numbers Foreman is giving out free drinks. Why? Well, maybe it's to to make up for the fact that my carrier isn't uh, restocking or refueling anybody. Oh boy, I haven't been so excited to get to a rock. Okay, you're you're rolling to the left for some reason. If you can roll back to the right, that'd be great because you're rolling to the left. Okay, pause your roll. You're good. Almost there. Yeah, right now is not a good time to try out um, FA off. <laughs> right. Well, hold on. Slow down. Slow down. Okay. Okay, we're going. Okay, we were at 1.27 kilometers last time. What's where are we at now? I'm glad we're in immortality right now because uh, less than a kilometer. Great, because our spacesuits would have run out of energy by now. So close. This is my. I have to keep my orientation right because if if he angles down a little bit too much, I'll I'll slide off. Let's see. That's good. Roll 
to the right just a tad. This feels like an actual NASA docking. Like we're actually trying to like dock with this uh, thing. Because when NASA, whenever they do anything that has to do with like meeting something in space, it takes like three hours, and uh, um, you go at a snail's place. And you got one shot. We already lost two crew members. Almost there. So close. Okay, slow down. Slow down. There we go. Slow down there. Okay. Okay, roll to the right a little bit. Alright. A little bit more. Okay, good. And at this point, okay, a little bit less, uh, a little bit to the left, and then let's let's uh, thrust up a bit. So um, raise our altitude. Thrust up just a little bit, a little bit at a time. Because, like I said, what I want to do, I I'll need to fall onto uh, the uh, the asteroid. It's going well. Keep these movements. These are good. Okay, hold on. Stop. Okay. All right. Let's go again. Guys, keep uh, uh, lighting up the rock because I can't see it if all the lights are on me. Stop. Okay, go again. Who is that? Who's lighting me up? Whoever's above me, I can't see the uh, the way the uh, the game works. It it uh, makes everything all dark where I am, and I can't see in front of us. Okay, stop there. Stop. 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 Okay. Okay, I'm back into position. All right, go forward. Uh, the uh, the uh, viper just went through the asteroid again. Is that thing solid? Martian turtle is in the rock. I saw you go in the rock. Alright, careful with that gunfire. Because if you hit <laughs> one of us, uh, I I will fall. Oh, Drunken, if you can stay below us in case I fall off, I can like, fall onto you. But just be careful. Don't like hit us from below. Okay, we're nearly at the thing. Oh god, we're almost there. Guys, if you can light up the rock a little bit more, so that way, because it's, it's all un in shade for me over here. Python, uh, Frakes, go ahead and turn your lights on too. Okay. Okay, pause here. Pause here. Now moving, I'm just going to go to the edge here, just look around. Almost there, guys. Almost there. Well, I'm gonna pause. We're gonna pause here just to take screenshots from here while we can, in case anything bad happens. So nobody move. If somebody can get above the python and shine the light down on top of the python, so I can see, I can see myself. Just be careful. Don't run into the python. Nearly there, so close. I feel like this is actual like uh, landing on a planet or something. Careful, whoever's underneath the python, don't run into us from from below. We're nearly there. Look at this view. We're so close. Okay, yeah, that's good. Stay down there because 
that's a good place to be. Um, it's a little bit lower, um, Junkin Commander. That way, in case I fall off, I fall onto your ship. But go no, go lower. Don't pitch up, but just go lower. Much lower. Okay, and then pitch down, uh, Corvette. Okay, hold on. Okay, now. Okay, good, good, good. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Python, stop moving. All right, let's go forward. Let's go forward if you can manage it. Um, you're perfectly level to to relative to my position. If you can go forward and up a bit, you're going too fast for me. You're going too fast. There we go. All right. If you go forward and then um, up a bit, yeah. That way, when I come down on it, I, I fall right onto it. I, now, I might fall through it. So if somebody can get ready and be underneath, that would be great. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to land a man <laughs> on an asteroid. Okay, go up some more, Python. Because we're nearly there. I could almost probably walk right off and land right on it. But I need to f to have something underneath me. Okay, careful. Back up, back up. Whoa, there went that guy. Okay, I'm gonna do some. Um, I'm gonna try to do. All right, I'm gonna try to do some screenshots here. Okay, we are literally right above it. Careful with your movements. Careful with the movements here. We're literally right above it. Okay, careful. Uh, roll to the right a little bit. That's enough. That's good. That's good. Okay, everybody stay your position. Don't move from this spot. This looks great. I just want to get some a footage of this in case we don't make it. I can't get too close to my uh, my character there, my character on the model, because for some reason the uh, the hit box of the Python pushes me back. I just want to get the shot that I am indeed out in the asteroid area. <laughs> I love that it's called unfortunate traitor. Like I'm just stuck out here, unfort in an unfortunate accident. All right. Okay, I'm gonna try now. Okay, let's. From you guys, from you guys in the uh, the ships, Martian Turtle, what do you advise me to go off of? Should I go off of the uh, the starboard bow here? Oh yeah, can I turn people's uh, lights off by clapping at them? No, only if it's my own ship. Okay, let me look off the edge. You should jump on the Corvette first, I think. Okay, let me look at where the Corvette is. Hold on. I see the Corvette. Okay. All right, guys. Here we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna go onto the Corvette. Okay, it's on this side here. Okay, here I go. I'm going to the Corvette. Alley-oop! Okay, I'm on the Corvette. Alright. Okay, Martian Turtle, where should I go now? I'm going towards the nose of the Corvette. Drunken Commander, you're doing great. Okay. I can't... Okay, and actually, I'm stuck here. Hold on. I can't get out of this spot here. There we go. Okay, I got out. Okay, do I go off the nose? There go. Can you guys light up the ground here for me? I'm on the nose. Light up the ground here. Okay. Light it up some more. Aim in front of me here. Okay. Here I go. Here I go. I'm landing. 
going on the... I did it! I'm inside. <laughs> this is what I wanted. <laughs> I'm inside of it. Goodbye. Goodbye, cruel world. It was all a dream. <laughs> oh, best day of my life. That was great. That was fantastic. Oh, that was cool. Hidden Tiger King. We, nobody cared, but we care now. We love this, these places. This is wonderful. Okay. Let's go to the last place on our on our trip. Go to my hangar. Let's go to Midoran Hollow. Oh, boy. Thanks, guys. That was great. Great teamwork by everyone. Frakes, you did an amazing job of getting us to the the asteroid. You only killed two of us. Let's see here. Junk Commander, you were a great job uh, catching me below you. Um, and everybody guiding us through to the to the very very end. Yeah, that's that was great. Okay, let's get to Midor and Hollow. It's not too far. Epsilon Indy. Epsilon Indy. Not too far. It's, there we go. Let's see. Six jumps. That's what I mean by not too far. Ah, oh, that was so fun. Oh boy. Now, I wonder how we can get onto one where you don't go through it. Let's see. Uh oh, I'm dying. <laughs> oh no. Who is that? Junk Commander, of course. Luckily, I am in a fast little guy. Don't wanna die. And my fast little guy. Alright guys, I'll see you at Epsilon Indy in um disemboweled um fleet carrier. Gonna jump through the rings. Through the rings. Anytime now, <laughs> I will jump through these rings. There we go. First of all, I'm glad you thought that was cool. This vault says another place that might be fun to go on an outpost like that is the hangars. They have, they do have collision and some different gravity. Jumpin', jumpin', Is the carry jumping? It, I. It is not jumping. I'll tell the jump. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna run out of time. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna tell the carrier. I think the carrier isn't gonna make it. Guys, we might have to save this for next stream. Let's see here.
right, hold on. We might have to... Cause I need to go s very soon, actually. We can save the Epsilon Indie thing for Saturday stream. Because I want... Because it's going to take 15 minutes to get it to jump. And said that I am sending the carrier to Epsilon Indy so we can all enjoy what it looks like from um, Disemboweled's spaceship there. So we'll at least, the very least, get to uh, to Mitter and Hollow to look at look at it through the uh, through the concourse there because that would be pretty crazy. And then next stream, we'll start out by um, jumping out, <laughs> jumping out of out of the carrier. This uh, dolphin is pretty great because no matter how close I am to the sun. I uh, don't overheat, which makes me wonder why I have the heatsink. Oh boy, freaks! How d I like um? I can't wait to see your footage, freaks. Okay, Epsilon in. They just one jump away. Yeah, so I think in my top four of the places we went to, definitely that last place was the best. It had a mix of the previous three um, with the added benefit of uh, EVA. Our next stream is on Saturday. Let's see, where is this thing? Where are you? There you are. If you guys are wondering which one uh, Disemboweled's um, ship is, it's this one. This is a big German one. Now I will say this this place is not forgotten nor hidden. Um, it's just really fun, and it's hard to get a fleet carrier here, so uh, that's why we're here. Oh seven con man ninety eight. Jesse Bob, I use heat sink to jump, to start a jump while refueling. Yeah, I sometimes have to do that too because. Um, Oh man, it's going by fast. Am I even going to be able to catch up with this thing? Okay, I do that too because sometimes my um, my ship, if I'm in a Type 10 or if I'm just really slow about refueling, I'll have to do the heat sink. Oh boy, it's tricky catching up with this as it's going around. I have a video of myself. Um, in an SRV in orbit around this place. Maybe we can do that on Saturday also. Okay, it's behind. Half the battle is just catching up with the planet. Okay, I need to fly away from the main planet. Otherwise, the gravity well is just going to slow me down all day long. Catching up speed, building up speed. Okay, come back around. <laughs> I just okay. Let me go this way.
Where is it? It's coming. It's coming around the corner. There we go. Okay, I, I cut it off at the pass. Oh, I got it. Okay, cool. Oh my god, we're going so fast. By the way, sometimes, hey guys, if you want to come here and look, oh my god, this is so jarring. This is so crazy. I feel motion sickness already. This is so weird. Okay, I'm trying to catch up with you. Okay. Okay, I don't even know what buttons to push anymore. Okay, docking pad number 15. Landing gear down. And... We're landed. First try. Refuel. Always refuel. Some bark. Yeah, Midder and you don't land on Midder and Hollow. It lands on you. Okay. Alright, let's get to the concourse. Oh, they hear that? No gravity here. As soon as we get to the concourse, we'll be set. Phantom of the Space is here. I'll look out there later. There we go. We're almost there. Okay, there it is. Wow! Look at that. If that is not a sunrise, a sky rise, that's nuts. All right, guys, we did it. We'll come back here. We'll 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 come back. We'll where we left off on Saturday. And thanks so much for joining. Hope you guys had a great time. And we'll wait for it to come back around one more time. What a great stream. What a great stream, guys. Thanks for coming. Any second now. Woohoo! I think the orbit is nine seconds. There it is. Oh, I thought it was. Okay, we're in the, we're in its shadow. Now it's back. There it is. Beautiful. Beautiful Mitter and Hollow. I might check out the other um, fleet carriers too. See what their points of view are. And that's it. Bye, guys. Bye.